<laughs> meow? The biggest meow ever, ladies and gentlemen. It's Quibo. Oh, all right. So, what's up? Meow? So, meow. All righty, gamers. Thank you so much for the 50 fucking gifties, dude. Uh, okay, there's some great. I'm going to just take us right to the fucking. Yeah, let's go right to the screen. Let's go right to, right to the waiting screen. So, Quibo, why don't you tell the wonderful people at home, anyone who isn't familiar, I assume everyone is because we've talked about it a lot. What's Quivo about? Quivo is a fighting game tournament that is going to feature a series of mysterious, unknown to all of the competitors' games that I'm choosing randomly on a wheel. As the tournament goes on, every single set is going to be a different video game that I'm choosing as the sets start happening literally <laughs> on stream. It's going to be, I'm, I'm spinning a little wheel. You're going to probably hear the wheel spinning sound effect. I'm you not going to, I did label the wheel exclusively with numbers. Like I, I have my little code system I figured yeah. out for all my games. Thank you, NB Dog, for the five gift subs. I have a little code system I figured out. Uh, so I, I don't know if I'm, I'm probably not going to show the wheel, but. That's it fine. is there. It is it there. It is there. We do it have is wheel. there. You'll there hear the sound wheel. effect of the wheel success. It's not a real physical wheel. It's wheelofnames.com. Everyone's favorite. Yeah. Um, that's pretty much it. We have. I can, I can show the bracket. Yeah, let's see the, the bracket. bracket. Let's, let's see the bracket. our wonderful competitors. Pretty much just about to jump into our first pool in a second here. Um, our bracket is. Whoa. We have uh, Pool Q. That's going to be our first one kicking us off. That's going to be Knack, Card Knight, and Cinna. Knack, as the uh, baby invite to you, is going to be the defender there. With Card Knight and Cinna fighting to try and take that top spot or Ooh. risking dropping the losers. We will have one person out of the tournament at the end of each of these pools, and two of them will be moving on. One in winners, one in the bottom half of bracket. I think we're just going straight through the pool, right? So it's yep. going to be Card Knight versus Cinna, and then are we doing... Then it is Knack versus the and winner. And then Knack versus the winner, and then it's going to be the two people who did not win versus each other. Yep. And, and then whoever, that's the then whoever loses that last matchup is out of the tournament. And following that, wins, it moves on to the losers bracket. Following that is Pool B. That is Popgun Arcade, Mock Roach, and Theo. That one, uh, whoever wins that one, will be moving on to fight the winners of Pool Q. Follow that, of course, with uh, many other lovely Quibo competitors: Cool Dude sixty nine and Neocat uh, facing off against Aubrey, and Tia and Carmela facing against Tyler. Once this is all set, you can see the round order below us. Everyone who makes out of these pools will be fighting off. For eight straight rounds up maybe even nine because we do have a reset bracket potential it is possible it is extremely possible and we'll bring it together everything is going to be a first to two set best of three so you have a couple of chances to get through this one all right i mean you want I, me I, to contact you want me to start our first pull up Queef, i think you need to select the game all right let me turn off this fucking music that keeps pausing itself anyways are you all ready to spin the wheel and get our first video game? Are you fucking ready? Let's see it. Well, Wait, before we do. Before we spin the wheel, we do have to do And I invite you, chat, to do this along with us. Before we spin the wheel. Every we time we spin the wheel, this is important. important. We have to say the gamer's prayer. Ready? <clears throat> yeah. I, I swear, swear before, before I spin, spin this wheel. wheel no drop of anger will I feel. No grains of salt course through my veins. No matter what may be my game, I'll take my hand and play it well. Thus save me from a gamer's hell. Spin it, Queen! Spin the wheel! All right, spin our fucking wheel. <laughs> oh boy, I'm excited, I'm excited. I'm, I'm still fucking excited. <gasps> oh, shit. One! Dude, one! One! one. Game number one. Game number one. What is game number one, one, dog? Our first game of the night. It's Alien Challenge. Well, it doesn't say that yet. It just says system ram. Test well, I have to. S I have to All send right. out. What alien what Challenge. <laughs> yeah, it's Alien Challenge. <laughs> it's what? Huh? No, it's like it's Alien Challenge. What do you mean? All what? Right. Uh... I've now get the fuck in there. Remember, you get one shot at a button check. This first round is a button check. You're gonna have exactly 60 minutes top. Oh, should I pull up the uh the, the scoreboard thing first? Um, what do you mean? Oh, like Oh yeah, you right. can bring it up, feel free. Alright, alright, hold on, hold on, hold on one second. Shoot this on the screen. 
Okay, okay, here we all go. Right, all right, all right, Drew. This is a button check. This is a button this check. There's a button check. There's the button check. This is not the official start. Figure your shit out. All right, they're all, all set. Right, Ladies all right, and gentlemen, right, here right, we right. go. The first round of Quivo is happening now. Hard on the left, Sin on the right. Zero, zero, fresh stock. I'm interested to see if they stick with their original characters, whether we get Drew and the Wolf out. Yeah, but... let's see what was gonna be the official That's first sick. matchup of Cleavo, the first characters that we're gonna get our lay our beautiful eyes on. It seems like Drew is being locked in. Drew, Drew and... In... Okay. I don't know his name, I completely forgot. Drew and Fang, that seems like a pretty understandable name. All right. Here we go. Full screen. All right, oh, I got the... Okay, so Drew... Karn is open with that projectile. Finding that out is really handy. Oh, and oh, looks like Drew's DP was located. Fang, I don't know if Fang's... I don't think that was a DP. Is it not? I don't know what the fuck that thing is, okay. but, you know... He has, like, a bark. Oh, a power! Okay, yeah, okay. Need... There are... no, Drew gets it! Power-ups do occasionally fall from the top of the sky, and you punch them to get them. That's one of the central features to Alien Challenge that's worth okay. remembering here. Here's the kicks. Fang's some opening. All right, Fang getting a little bit of business Whoa! on here. Oh, almost Idle. takes through! Almost makes it through with the spot dodge, but just barely gets caught by the back of that bowling pin. But this is a three. Yeah, you got three attempts here. This is a first to three fighting game. <laughs> so, that's only one. There's a lot of work to be done here still. Whoop. Uh. So they're not moving. What's going on here? I'm checking the Discord. No, we're back. We're back. Okay, we're, we're back. Good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. <laughs> I think it might not have been aware that that round was ended. There goes Santa. Right, there's, okay. the, there's the roast chicken. Fang needs it. Right, the, Fang, Fang needs, needs the roast chicken. chicken. Ignoring the roast Nobody chicken. Nobody gets the chicken. Nobody gets the power. Going for that big heavy kick. Drew notably using, I think, his fart move. I don't know what's going on with that one. I don't really understand. Locked okay. in clutch, but Drew takes the second round. Drew gets it with his little uh, stick. Oh, he turned into a little puppy. That's kind of oh, cute. That's kind of cute. <laughs> Drew's victory animation blows me away, dog. So what's happening so far from what I'm seeing is uh, Drew's catching these overheads. That's the DP. That, that's DP what I was into about. stun. Oh into my gosh, and the stun. And who gets the burger? burger? Nobody gets the burger, burger, but Fang needs, burger. Fang needs that burger right now. Had a deficit again. I will say, I have played Wait. a decent amount of Alien Challenge. Fang, bringing it back. Okay, so okay, 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 okay. Oh, oh it's, it's not over. It's Fang not found over. Some buttons. Fang found some buttons. Um, I was gonna say, I, as a person who played this, Drew has some buttons and moves that are kind of easy to find. Fang's moves are He's got the moves. They're a little bit harder to find based uh, solely on your human intuition. Uh -huh. These uh, The blocks of Sinna are on point right now. Yeah, this is really in. good. There's the roast chicken. Okay, Get the, the power! power. Get right, the roast power chicken! Fang drew at a deficit this time. First time I've seen that in a second this early in the round. And Sinna's bringing it back. Oh, no, I'm not going to call it yet, because the, these right. bowling pins are still flying. Right, he's right. out to grab. I have no idea what damage it's going to do. That's a huge Kind of a lot. Kind of a lot. Oh, my God. Next Almost the air. That's, who is that? No. True. Who is this? True takes it on the last hit. Oh, my God. With a heavy train. That looked like such a big attack. I had no idea you'd take it. But update the score. Update the score. All right. Before you go on, let me, let me, let me update the score really fast. All right, that's Carnet with what? This is first to three, or this, this is this first is to two. It's first best, best of three. three. Yeah, best of three. I mean, it's not so first to two. Um, you can press start to continue. I will press start for you. All right, so here's the thing, though. Arcade game structure dictates Card Knight is bound to Drew. All right, I was going to say, Sina had the opportunity to change yep. things up there. A lot of the arcade games that might be showing up uh, at Quivo, if you win, you are stuck with your guy. Yep. If you lose, you can change your guy out. That grab is that grab's huge. Look how much damage that does. A whole, that's probably and like it a sends you full card. screen, which is kind of where Drew wants you. That bowling pin move just makes him a pretty effective zoner. What what Sin is doing well is he's starting to deal with the bowling pin in a really good way, and that's really opening up what the options against Drew here. And he's finding these short little combos. Oh, the spinach, the spinach, the spinach, Popeye's favorite. Nobody gets it. Nobody gets it. That's huge. Grab. Oh, but Fang with the grab, and that does a kind of a ton of damage again. An immense amount of damage. This so is from the Street Fighter 2 era where grabs were the thing that yeah. do a bit of damage. Is that oh gonna be enough? Is that enough? Does Oh, just kill. a little bit. Can Drew pull this back? There's the spacing. Oh, the bowling pin. That kills. No way. 
I didn't think that would do that much. I didn't think that would do so I much. I thought that was gonna be like a like a magic pixel almost. Through with the air train thing. sneaking through. See, I was so curious if Sinnoh would switch, but I was gonna say it feels like Sinnoh is starting to feel out Fang. Fang has some pretty strong normals. He's got these big fat normals which are just going so far. Like that kick is that's crazy. I don't know if we've actually seen almost any special moves from Fang at all. <laughs> um, a couple but though, I think that's that wrong. heavy kick is huge. Yeah, but I, and this is a dominating round yeah, for this Fang. Is, if you oh, are jump Sinnoh, this is what you want to see. Yeah, be careful though, you don't want to lose this one. Nice it's a great defense. opportunity. A little bit of a cross, up, cross up. doesn't do much. Nope. And oh, interrupting the bowling pin. The punish on that bowling pin is so huge. It's a great projectile, but it leaves you wide open. Which, uh, for someone like Santa who's starting to capitalize on these straight hits, uh, Card is really gonna have to struggle dealing with it. We'll trade. There's the projectile. Push to the corner. Gets, oh, gets the hamburger. Bang I think that's hamburger? a power one. I don't think that's health. I think this one's power. That's power. Most of them, they all have pretty clear labels on them. I think power is just a flat damage increase. Yeah. So there's really no reason to not go for them if you uh, don't have to go out of your way for it. And they definitely didn't have to go out of their way for it then. But bang! Huge combo! There's oh the my grab. god, the grab's gonna even stuff out kind of a lot. Heavy! What next hand? Oh my god, that was a ton of damage. The next ah, situation, Drew barely sneaking in. Oh man, with the that jumping kick. That was crazy. All right. Lingering hitbox with the Drew kick really locking that up. But Card Knight and Sinner are just trading here. Really? This is a well fought match. Trying to find a punish for that jumping. There's really good spacing from both Card no, Knight and Sinner here. This is the most competitive I've ever seen uh, Alien Challenge be played. Maybe I think. ever. Yeah. Wait, oh, huge thing stun. done, thing's done, but Card Knight not capitalizing on it with anything other than a bowling pin. It's gonna be, it's almost impossible. But, oh my back. god, it's a big jump. A nasty situation here. That's it, the perfect. Card takes it with a perfect. And ladies and gentlemen, Card Knight. It's our first advancing player of Quibo after a really well fought match against Sina. That was really, really close though. That was crazy. That was kind of a It's a dog. <laughs> it's a dog. It's a dog. Cinna, congratulations. Uh, Cardinet, congratulations. Cinna, congratulations. I was going to say Cinna well fucking fought. I didn't. That was much closer than I thought it would end up. Um, yeah, no, that was, that was really close. I will say, so uh -huh. my little bit of game knowledge here, I will say, Drew is, I think, one of the most fucked up characters in that game from what I know. Yeah. From what I know, Drew is fucked up. So I, I, I think that is demonstrated a little bit. That that guy's got a lot of tools to bust he has a out. Ton of tools. And having tools in like a Street Fighter 2 era fighting game is such a huge thing. Yeah, for a fighting game nobody was expecting, it looked like you knew exactly what you were doing, which is crazy. Alright, well god damn. Saw the Wolfman character and committed. Here's the thing, that character has an infinite. <laughs> that character does have an infinite. All right, so Cinna goes. Yep, down. Cinna goes down. All right, Cinna goes down to losers, and Card Knight will be facing off against Knack. Moves on is gonna face up against Knack. Let me kind of. This is a little bit. Uh, oh wait, no. Before we do that, I'm gonna spin the wheel. Oh, you're gonna spin the wheel? Okay. <clears throat> oh, here we go. I swear, I swear before I spin, I spin this, this wheel, no drop of anger will I feel. No though grains of salt course through my veins, no matter what may be my game, I'll, I'll take my hand and play it well. The save me from a gamer's hell. Spin it! I'm spinning the wheel, and then Card Knight can come back into yep. my parsec. I kicked you because I forgot that that doesn't really <laughs> matter at all. Oh, wait. Oh, my God. Oh! Ooh. Ten? Ten? What's ten? <laughs> it's Street, Street Fighter, Fighter the, the movie, movie the, the game. game. That's such a pull. All right. That's such a pull, dude. All right, All right. get in there, y'all. Akuma looks like such fucking shit. Akuma this game. looks Jesus good. Christ. He looks really good. They all look good. <laughs> looks like the fucking Hawaiian Punch guy. This is maybe one of the best takes on Ken I've seen. He's just it's like a bad, like a really normal white guy. Oh, is Nat going shit. for Keith? Are we <gasps> Nat locking in This Keith. is a risky move. This I do want to say, move. this is a risky <laughs> fucking move. <laughs> this could Keith either Chun. pay off Keith massive Chun. or be a big problem. Oh my god, okay, and Chun Li attack. with the little Whoa! kicks already. Nat feeling it out. Go Had a punish window there, nothing for it though. 
So the thing about Zangief is, this is important to mention. Yeah. We are doing keyboard controls only. Yes. <laughs> for this for this tournament. Zangief famously is a character that relies pretty heavily on those big 360 movements on a joystick. Those are pretty fucking hard to pull off on a keyboard. I have no fucking clue what Geef does over here, dude. I also don't There's know. One oh, I saw I something. I think I saw a Lariat come out for a second. There's the Lariat. Chun is, is below everything, dude. Nax located a move, but Card Knight, like... There's the punishes, though. All these Chun Lee moves are coming out, but... Oh, that's kind yeah, of... Yeah, the kicks! <laughs> Someone's pressing buttons, too. Someone is pressing buttons on my keyboard, which is very scary. Because those are not buttons you're supposed to be pressing. I, I'm noticing Nax starting to figure out that crouching low is a really good tool for any fighting game that you're in, but it's standing low because above Chun! Oh, the crouching lows are kind of bringing stuff back a little bit, though. Zangief in the danger zone. Oh, with a nice little drop kick there. I think that'll do it. All right, all right. Card Knight takes game one. All right, all right. Let me uh, update this thing. Oops, not that. There we go. There you go. You have achieved a place in history. <laughs> and initials. Let's not do that. Yeah, let's, let's, there we go, there we go. Knack leaving the Geef. I think that's the right play. I feel like Geef feels so hard in this game, especially. In this game, especially. This game and it does looks like not. We're getting two swaps. Blade. Oh shit! Blade. The Blade's a lot of matchup. This is huge. Knack going for Blade. Actually doing it. Knack going for Blade in the background. I see action happening. Clips from the movie are playing in the background. Two ones. Two ones. Two ones. It's okay. It's allowed in the Street Fighter the movie the video game. They are trading <laughs> to medium kick. The low kick battle. Who's going to come out on top? I don't think anyone's found a move yet. Wait, oh, Sawada finds a move. Sawada finds a move, and it's kind of a big one. Oh, All right. Oh, okay. we're frozen too very much. Little frozen throw, but very it's not that. Game. Th this is past the Street Fighter 2 era, I think. The, the things are more Mortal Kombat style here. These are throws for position. I have this strange feeling that Blade is a charge character. I don't know Blade why. is serving charge character vibes when I'm looking at him. He's like he's reminding me of a charge character, but we're mostly seeing little pokes. <laughs> okay, so that was so short. Why is Blade's little it. jump kick okay, thing so on short? Match point. Neck on match point. All right. I have so much respect for these two competitors for not picking Ryu. Like, this I is, need to emphasize that. I was expecting Whoa. every single, like, game that has someone that looks like a Shoto to have the Shoto picked immediately. And that's Ryu. I was expecting yeah, to see Ryu. You all know a Ryu input when you see one. I think Knack is going for little damage and a timeout. I think that's the strat right now. I think Knack is trying to... He's doing the H-box, you know? If I was awesome. Knack... I would be going for a timeout. Just get your pokes. You have 30 seconds. It's a fast round. Oh my god, oh, but in the corner. Yeah. Oh my god, in the corner. This is... I have no idea who has the lead. Hard Knight has a lead here. Danger. Negative danger. danger zone. Oh, he has the lead. He has the lead. He has the lead. No, Magic Pixel. Can something happen here? Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Brings it back a little bit. Brings it back a little Back bit. with the magic oh, pixel oh, staying oh, alive yeah. against all odds. And learning one move in the process. It looks like a bad move, unfortunately. <laughs> it, looks like it, very good. it looks like Blade, the original character for Street Fighter, the movie, the game, doesn't have a very good move. But these jump-ins are doing good, doing a lot of work for him. This is... So, next current... Uh, his bread and butter right now is mixing between the low and the standing medium kicks. That's the variation. And trying to read that jump in. Because you need to make sure he can hit. And he wants the damage off, off of the standing one. I like... Oh no. It's gonna be close. Can it happen again though? There's no way. There's no way. He doesn't know any moves. He's trying for one. Oh my god. No! Knack putting up everything he had and honestly almost taking it back. But going down to the loser's bracket. Oh, oh my man. god. That was close. That was actually close at the end there. Good game. Next, the stay in that stay in. You're coming up next. I respect I respect trying to fucking figure out, for the love of God, how to make Blade and Sawada work. 
I think that there's something really cool about trying to make those <laughs> motherfuckers do something. No, absolutely. All right. Uh, let's go back to the main screen. We have another game to pick. We do have another game to pick, and we have a little bracket to move around. So Card Knight is moving up. Officially the winner of Pool Q. Congratulations, yeah, Card Knight. Knight here. Yep, right up there. All right, Card Knight's going to go here, and Knack is going to be taking on Cinna. <laughs> Maybe. Let's go to versus mode. All right. There you go. Get in there, the both of you. This is crazy. This is our button check so, again. Little button, button check. check here. I feel like Knack should know that there's someone to pick. Oh, wait, he's not Knack in this game. Fuck, dude. Hey, this character has multiple names. When do you stop being Knack? Is that a different guy? Bark versus Fang. <laughs> this is an interesting matchup if it's what everyone ends up sticking yep. with. Button check, button check. Let's see. All right, Let's do see the button it. check. Figure this shit out. <laughs> I Whoa! Think I'm a, what a stage this is a sick stage, actually. I love a plane stage. I'm a sucker. All right, for all right. Stage. So Fang obviously has a zoning tool with the little gun, and that's so this is dangerous. Oh! Oh, that's fucking so much damage. Fang trying his dumb about. What? Oh, grab. the grab. All so right. So Nack is going for the zoning play, but Bark has such like good damage when he gets in. Nack when he has gets in, he just fucking claps him. There's a cross up. Oh, tries to cross up. Kick Double out kick. of the way. And the dunk. All right. On him. This game's damage is nuts. <laughs> the damage is nuts. I don't Look think I've seen Bark play. Bark did take away half of things how far in one hit. <laughs> this looks good for Nack, but he's got the corner here. Oh my god, Double and being in the corner, you don't want to be in the, You do not want to be in the corner versus Bark the Polar Bear. This Nack, guy doesn't- Oh! Knack went for a play where he tried to approach back and forth using a shield, gets called oh down the jump. That's huge. Big damage. Oh my god. Step oh. away, step away! There was some juggle oh god, no. there, but I don't blame Knack for not going for it. <laughs> two takes it! That means player two, two wins! wins. <laughs> the draw gives one to both, it goes to Knack. <laughs> Alright, the double! Uh, let's just go to character change. Just, yeah. just, I'm just gonna do this for safety's sake. Yeah. If one of you wants to change, that's crazy. This game is at, this game is like a scene now. I think that's what you do more damage at low health. Sonic and Knuckles. Oh my god. Oh my god. A Na tail is all this Knuckles. time. <laughs> Mac is Knuckles. Cinna playing Sonic. A classic matchup we've all seen at many times in our play. life at their favorite place to be. Now, I don't know how much this is going to apply in the actual gameplay. I think Knuckles is the best character. Knuckles is by far considered the best character in Sonic the Fighter. Like, by a fucking country mile. Every other character in Sonic the Fighters, <laughs> I think, is punches. like, oh, this guy has a niche of some sort. Knuckles think, is just, like, the best one. I think Knuckles has a glide? He probably has some Wait, this shit. This is big, this is big. But OTG! One more! If Knack gets the OTG, oh. he wins, he doesn't know what to do! Oh my god, no! <laughs> Cinna! Taking that one. Okay, here we go, here we go. Alright, Sonic's starting with that. You can't, it's hard to do cross ups in this game. There's a lot of time. This is it. You get about 1,000 minus frames after you jump in this game. You're just sitting there. Sonic seems to be working out a little bit better. But here's than the thing the polar Sonic is character. slowly running out of his block. Oh, yeah, there is a block meter. Sonic's almost out, but Knuckles with only one little pip left. However, that means a huge damage boost, potentially. Oh, he no! no! breaks the shield and gets him with the follow-up. Do they all have that can-can kick? They all have a three-hit uh, three oh, well, cycle. Uh, this is this is one and one. Yes, one and Dude, one. Dude, one and one. one. All right, first actual fucking... This game is three! It, uh, first game three! First elimination, Quibo life on the line! Your Quibo existence is hanging on by a... Oh, game. God. Uh-oh. Oh god. Oh, this is an This is bad, one. dude. This is bad. Rosie the Rascal. You don't want to see what Rosie the Rascal's up to. Rosie the Rascal's got a few tricks up her sleeve. <laughs> oh no. If Nat finds what I think if is Nat the best gets the in this video the game. Hit it. That was crazy. Boom, oh, boom. Boom. it's fo Oh no, Amy's strongest move, her hammer. Wait, the tongue attack. Boom, boom, boom. Oh no, but the bear is blocking it. it and it didn't actually break any barriers. So we're back That's to the even matchup. What the fuck was that? Boom, I don't know, but gets him with the third hit on the hammer. Knack trying to space that hammer, but espio has got the big tongue. Knack doesn't know. Boom, boom, boom. Amy is a character who seems extraordinary. Amy, boom, boom, boom. That's it. Amy's the one worst more, character one more. in the game, you say. I don't think so. Amy, <laughs> that hammer. Amy, here's the thing. If you are an informed Sonic the Fighters character yeah. uh, player, 
Amy probably is not the best character in the world. But in a context like this, Amy's hammer is such a good fucking move. In I mentioned at the start of this. Like, look at it! <laughs> it's so hard to... This, it, 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 this is a knowledge check thing. In this context, Amy has a huge advantage on a lot of things. Oh! But Watch I still bring it back, taking advantage here. And that tongue is not a bad move. Oh, catching the, the crab, crab. punishing the hammer. He's figuring it out. There's the three. Time over. Time up. Time up. Round three. Round three. This is it. Someone's going home right now. Goes for the hammer, doesn't get it. Man, does get the last hit. Third hit getting SBO. Amy getting knocked no into the corner of the ring. Just getting bounced around. The OTG on Amy. That's Ooh, the first time we've seen huge. that. Mac doesn't know how to get that one. There's the hammer. All right, Amy had a little tiny bit here. This could be anyone's game. Dude, Knack is, playing, Knack is trying to play so safe. OTG might kill. That's it. No. <laughs> that no way. Oh. A bunch of a, bu a bunch of buttons just got hit on my keyboard. <laughs> that that surprised me. Oh my god, crazy. Knack eliminated from the tournament. Can, thank you so much for playing. Thank you so much for playing. Someone popped off. That was actually... No, that was a good uh, fucking switches, set. Switches the set. That was a great set. That was a really good set. I, I will, think... I will say that was a good fucking set. That is the set of the tournament. I love that. I was going to say the thing that I said is I was like, Synth, you should have just played Amy and spammed her fucking ha hammer move. It but, worked for a second, but... Yeah, that, we got I, the matchup check. Na so where does not Cynicos here? Yeah, Cynicos up next days. So what happened there, uh, you could see it. Cinna figured out how to deal with that third hit hammer. Yeah. And that changes everything. Because it's if I block the last hit, then I can punish. I can grab. And that was a figured out how to grab check. No, exactly. It was saying, like, you're 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 no matter what this move puts you next to me, I'll punish it. So it made Nax big disjoint somewhat irrelevant if you could get the block out because amy's doesn't break through the shield amy's thing not breaking through barrier is like i think the major drawback of that move it yeah. leaves you pretty vulnerable if you get fully blocked out but i also think that that was not a bad approach to the character for like <laughs> no, for, for, for like a context like this well, hey, you know what? Uh, Thank you so much. I know you're the first props. to be eliminated from Quivo, but you put up a good fight. You are wonderful. No, Fly some hands together. Thank I you. think that was some good matches. That was some good matches in pool number Q. Pop Thank, Thank you, you Nack. so much. Shouts out to Nack. I think that was a good showing. Ladies and gentlemen, as I said, this is like... <laughs> <laughs> this is a tournament where you're going to get some fucking bullshit thrown at you. And it's funny because a lot of these games are real games, which is really scary for these upcoming pools because not all these games are real games. That dude. was, I, I have to say, that, that fucking uh, pool was three of the games that I would personally, if you're wondering <laughs> how I would judge the games at Quivo, I would say that was three of the closer to real games. That we had there. Mockroach, you are going to be, be player one. Popgun, you're going to be player two. But before we do that, can we hold our hands together and say the gamer's prayer? I swear before I spin this wheel, no, no drop, drop of anger, anger will, will I feel. feel. No, no grains, grains of salt course through my veins. veins. No, no matter what, what may be my game. My game. game. I'll, I'll take my hand and play it well, but save, save me from a the gamer's hell. hell. I'm going to spin the wheel, and Let's then I'm going to get you motherfuckers in here. I actually have no idea. High number. Oh, shit. 17, 18, 18! What was that? This might be a really... Oh, man, oh, man. What was that? No! Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! <laughs> Okay, okay, this is actually great. I was really hoping that if this game came up... I don't want this game to be in Losers. I don't want this game in Losers. You're all so blessed this game isn't in Losers. I am, This is the game I've been really worried about. All I've been actually, like, freaked out about this one because if this game cost somebody their run, oh, I would be God. really fucking sad. Remember the gamer's prayer. Remember the gamer's Today, prayer. Today, we're playing Dragon Ball GT Final Bout for the PlayStation 1. Oh, my God. This is by far Mean Queef's least favorite game in this tournament. This game makes me actually angry to play. All right, the official start. 
of the beginning of pool... Whichever one this is. I can't check. Begins now. Oh, wait. So, let's see how strong you are. Switching so, to Goku, no little Goku. Goku grew up. Goku's not the man he used to be. He's an adult now. All right. Let's see how this goes. <laughs> not Goku. Markarch on the right? Figuring out the side step. All right, so lots, far of, enough. lots of key blasts from Goku. Oh no, oh no, they're figuring it out. They're trying to right. block. Pop Gun is in the, the, the best situation you get in this game where you can get just really, <laughs> really stun locked. Oh, but hold on, breaking it back a little bit. Key blast, key blast, key blast, key blast, key blast. Key blast. Key blast. But make sure to watch your key meter. You might key run out of key. Key meter rapidly. You're running out of key. Pop Gun Arcade bravely saving a little bit of key which will be very necessary for the battle to come. It looks like Pan just does not do almost any damage. I do want to make that very clear. Pan is doing a lot less damage with every single hit than Goku is. <laughs> like kind what of the a- fuck was that? Oh, was that a shot? <laughs> All right. So, just as I've thought. I don't remember if there's I a think round there's two. Rounds. I think there's rounds. I'll give it two rounds. I'll give it two rounds. Yes. Hit, yes. Yeah. We're, we're going to say this is two rounds. We're doing our own two rounds. Yep. Well, well, we're doing yes. We're doing yes. The retry is going to count as our round two because yeah. that was a little bit fast. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ, dude. All right. Uh, so it's looking like the strategy is staying pretty similar. This no, we got the mostly... kick. Pan okay. kick's coming out. Oh, Look. and the kick just teleports Pan forwards in a strange way. That's kind of huge. Wait, Goku's- Oh, but Goku with the instant transmission Dude. punch. Goku just so much more damage. It's not even funny. What the fuck is this? Goku just fucking annihilated <laughs> Pan. Oh my god, what the one health, one hit just tears through Pan. Oh, but the key blasts colliding. What a huge moment. <laughs> Pan goes down the Popcorn Arcade. You got a block on a pool. Okay, so here's a fun fact about this game. Uh, <laughs> I, I'm going to say no. Yeah. Because if you want to change characters, you can. That counted as one. Yeah, that's one round. That's what, one round. That, that was one round. That counted as one round. Game over. Update the update the numbers. I did. <laughs> Right, the Strive Mach Killer. <laughs> Mockroach takes round one. So, with adult Goku. Again, in case anyone didn't hear, to fly, you hold the movement button and press up. Okay, wait, new matchup. Super Vegeta versus Trunks. I can't believe that Goku does that much damage. Well, he is Goku. Yeah, I know, but He's he was the just strongest kicking character. the shit out of his daughter. <laughs> he was beating the fuck out of his... All right, hey, start man, strong. You want to spar with me? <laughs> Starting, starting strong with a with a couple of key blasts. Oh wait, wait dude, it's over. Oh no, Mockroach figures out how to fly. <laughs> Pumpkin Arcade trying to figure out how to fly. Can Trunks fly? I think so. I think so. <laughs> They're coming back down. <laughs> Vegeta has found. All right, Mockroach has found Super Vegeta's fastest move, and it's kind of huge. What the fuck is that? All right, but lots of shit. Like, what are you I don't know why the camera is totally focused on Super Boom. Vegeta. Super <laughs> so Vegeta's taking no damage. Every single time that Super Vegeta takes damage, the camera just pans to him for some reason. Pop Gun had a huge advantage there, but is out of key and can't do any key blasts right now. <laughs> All right. Uh, Pop Gun Arcade in the key trap. That's a place you don't want to be. Taking a couple of hits there, and that was a big hit. You noticed Vegeta. Uh, right there, Pop Gun was holding block. <laughs> nah, Pop Gun was holding block. This is a fun fact about this game. Block is non consistent. There's no low overhead system. Block just doesn't work on some moves. Alright. This is it. <laughs> it captured its power perfectly. Vegeta's iconic Vegeta punch. Second half of the round. Ten Pop Gun Arcade take a trying everything that that wait that move does good. That okay, good. wait. Pop Gun Arcade finds one of Trunks' better moves. I think that the strat here is win this match by the skin of your teeth and then give a shot at getting fucking Vegeta Goku in there because you just can't out damage this. It feels like this is one of those types of games where some characters are just straight up better. <laughs> what even happened? <laughs> Super Vegeta's not even fucking <laughs> connecting. All right. <laughs> now, hurry and 
Cockroach <laughs> takes the first round. <laughs> takes the first set, I guess, of pools. Who will be? When me and Queef tested this game, uh, Queef hit me with fucking Frieza, and like Frieza has a close range energy blast that you just can't do anything. You get hit once, you're fucking done. You're done. <laughs> so, Popcorn Arcade. I'm sorry that that was that has to be your introduction to Quivo. That's a rough one. Oh my god. Bright side. The bright side. I think that's actually the worst the worst game in the whole tournament. That that one is probably the, the, the worst. That is probably the worst one. I do think that's a fair assessment to make. Oh my I'm gonna god. Keep the music right in the background though. It's kind of nice. So that was Mock Mockroach you won. Hey, thank you both of you for fucking playing that, by the way. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, Mockroach. Theo. Moves on to the finals of Pool B. Top Gun Arcade goes down. Losers. I swear before I spin this wheel. No drop, no drop of, of anger will I feel. No, no grains, grains of salt course through my veins. No matter what may be my game. game. I'll, I'll take my hand and play it well, thus save, save me from, from a gamer, gamer hell. <laughs> Let's spin the fucking wheel again. Hey, game in. Dragon Ball GT Final Bout thankfully gone from the wheel. We don't have to see it again. That was a match of you versus the game. You were both, one of you just had to die to kill it. Dude, game number 16. Staying on the PlayStation 1. Oh, dude. <laughs> this is maybe the last <laughs> one was the best games. This one might be the worst game lineup. This is a this really is, oh air, man. no! Oh no, dude! Oh no! This is, this is horrible. Oh fucking man! I can't dog. believe that I have to get both of these games in my pool. This, this, might... That's the tone. The, if the losers is like a really good game, though, I'll be pretty happy. I have, I have my hopes. Again, the bad games are slowly being forced out. It's a purge. It's probably for the best that some of these go away earlier, Again, but... I'm so glad that... I think... I don't know if there's any other game I mind being in losers. Masters of Paris Kasi also is not going to eliminate anybody. But this is a big round. Yeah. Oh, no. No! Hardinos? <laughs> Oh, fuck, horror ditto! It's not the fucking horror ditto! This is the size the fate of somebody! Someone's gonna go into winners! Horror versus horror! Horror versus. Alright, let's see what we got here. Starting with fucking bare knuckle brawling what from you think, horror. beige horror or blue horror? I like blue horror's kind of like. Kind of oh, oh, oh no, Theo, watch out! Three, three out! Three. Three. Oh no! Oh, we're good, we're good, we're good. It is worth noting, this is a ring out style video yeah. game. This is a perilous place to be playing this game right now, right near the corner of the map. Right this now, Theo is taking out the weapon, trying to see what to do about it, but, but Theo's in a bad the edge. Oh my god. Wait, no, 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 okay. Huge, actually. Spacing. The Boom. nice reversal, some of the spaces. Boom, Boom. Boom. found in the air. I don't know if they're on the grounds in this I game. think there are. Oh, the crouch going under it. Going for the lights. Going for lights, but Mockroach kind of needs to get that weapon out. Yeah, we kind of have- Whoa! I, I do have to say, as someone who has spent some time in the Masters of Terrorist Kasi mines, there is almost no reason to play without your weapon out. It's eight a... seconds! Eight seconds! Five, four, three, Oh, that's but it. there's overheads! Mockroach found one. the overhead, but it's just a little bit too slow to take out Theo on that first one. This game is kind of sick also. That's maybe like the Star Wars nerd in me, but this is kind of sick. Weapon out. Had the time to take it. Oh, oh punch! Nice, that, actually. Kind that could have nice led hit. to some fucking stinky ass combo, dude. Oh, double weapon out. Theo puts the oh my god by mistake. I think Mockroach he was finds a pretty good move there with the horizontal swing, forcing Theo to the edge. This not is a scary enough. place to be. You do not want to be near the edge in this game. It is so fucking easy to get ring outed in Star Wars: Masters of Terrascasi. If it, this could be anyone's game, the health is. Oh still my god! Close. They're just competing with over. Alright, Mockroach takes number two here. Final round. Okay, Mockroach Theo. Big Even kick. out, this is a oh, huge one. Put the weapon on, oh, never mind. Oh, uh, Mockroach push the weapons away. Mockroach taking out the gaffa stick immediately. Mm -hmm. 
The range is so big, dude. That overhead is just. Oh Theo, my god. Don't go that far. Don't Theo go that far, Theo. Don't go that far. Theo, in a dangerous situation. <laughs> oh my god. Switch around. That was so clutch from both players. That was some good ledge play. Yeah. I like to see that. If I was in this situation, I would. Whoa! Oh my god. Down the move. Lock rush down the move. Lock rush. Lock rush. Theo, the moves. <laughs> Everybody's finding horse moves. 20 seconds. Oh my god, but Theo has my Theo, go right. ring up! Oh. Mach takes it! Mach takes it! Mach approach with round one. <laughs> Hard gets, game. gets crunched down into a little cube or something. Alright, that's Mach approach with round one. This is ridiculous. Are we gonna see some new characters? The change. Doc? Luke? 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 Luke. <laughs> All right, all right. There you go. There you go. Horror, Horror versus okay, Luke. Hold on. Let's hear. Let's hear him say it. Horror versus Luke Skywalker. <laughs> all right. There it is. Yes. Yeah, thought. Thought Round versus Horror. All right. This is. I. I don't know. Is it? So the. I. I, I will say. Uh -huh. Lightsabers are kind of the king yeah, of Masters of Terrakasi. They're probably the best weapon type in the video game, but there's also wait, wait, no denying. Wait. I was gonna say <laughs> there's no denying that Mockroach managed to find a move with Horror. Yeah. And this game has insane inputs for all yes, the moves. For everything. If you managed to find a move on a character, that was a crazy jump over the horizontal swing of Duke Skywalker. So from hard Theo, right here. By the way. Oh, oh, and on the yeah. ground. The, that little OTG damage is going to be... No! That looks like a perfect avoid! It's so evened out. Oh, uh, Luke Skywalker just swipe it at Horns. The low attacks, the All right. This is looking Thanks scary, but not over at all. Theo staying in with the timer. anything but... Oh, no! The most fucked up cross-up in the world, like, actually. What the fuck is that wind pose, Luke? I got you, whore! Trying to go the run in. Oh, boxing! This is a bad play. I, I get this... the thought. You want to try and outspeed them? This is a bad play. Lightsabers are so fucking fast. Lightsabers are not slow at all. The the the, the stick oh, shit. is the stick is one of the slower weapon types in this video game. I think, but uh -huh. it's definitely still probably. Wait, 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 I like that. That sometimes that just happens. All right, go for the ring out. Go for the ring out. Oh my god, this is a. Ah! Oh my god. Ah! He just got no foul! He fell like a foot! He fell like a foot down! <laughs> that mod rush That's it? Mod rush taking it! Oh my fucking god. Oh my god! Mock roach. Taking it. I do want to confirm that that was mock on the right. That was mock I need on to right. confirm. Yeah, okay, mock, okay. mock's on the right. Mock was on the right. Mock was on the right. Oh my god. Unless you were all pressing the wrong buttons or something. But I'm pretty sure Mach was on the right. <laughs> oh my god. That was so much better than I thought it would be. That, that was like relatively close. For Masters of Terrorist Posse, that was kind of a hype set. Like actually, that was just crazy. Thank you, Tyler, for the gift sub. Your time's coming soon too, buddy. Mach with the pop-off. Winner of Cool Boot. Mockroach moving on to winners after getting through the most miserable pool, hopefully over the course of the entire tournament, and Theo going down, going to be sparring with Pop Gun Arcade for a spot in the loser's bracket. But what are they going to play? Let's find out. What are Theo and Pop Gun Arcade going to compete in? Let's find out after we say the, day, the, the, the gamer's prayer. How about we do that? Yeah. I swear before, before I spin, spin this wheel, wheel no, no drop, drop of anger will I feel. No, no grains, grains of salt course, course through my veins, no matter what may be my game. I'll take my hand and play it well. This will save me from a gamer's hell. No, we're... Oh, wait, no, there's a lot of games left that could be bad. Cool Boot refuses to leave the PlayStation 1. 14, I think that's an arcade game. <laughs> no, it's fucking not. Wait, is, wait, this, is this what, what I... I think it is? This is the redemption arc, dude. This, this is, is a good the one. Fucking... I like this one. And this is the fucking redemption arc, bro. This is a good game. All right. Let's see our first round of Evil Zone. Is I'm, it going to I, be live versus Galley? Because that's an unconventional matchup in this game. I haven't seen either of these characters. You're oh, mad that this is what they get with me while you got dog shit? You <laughs> got to win! 
Hey, remember the gamer's prayer, Mockroach. Gamer's prayer. Say the gamer's prayer five times. You wouldn't want to go to gamer hell, would you? All right. So this is interesting. These are the two high damage characters. In are this they? Game. Yeah. Uh, okay, let's get some Why is a character who you would expect to be kind of a magic zoner guy? Uh-huh. Uh, I think he's actually pretty strong at close range. Which obviously, Gally, who has a big fucking sword, is pretty good at that too. Let's see it. Who is this? Popgun and Theo? Yeah. Popgun putting some pressure on. Theo with the walk Pop around goes for a big move. Doesn't anything for it. on the left Blocks it. Line. Short combo. Up oh my right. god. Huge fucking geyser out the ground. Waiting for it. The geyser move is so fucking good right now, dude. The geyser is pretty big. I, 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 I'm looking at... So the way that this works, if you ever played Evil Zone, it's entirely directional and hooks with one button. Yeah. And there is kind of a process figuring out what your button... What your inputs do. Yeah. What I'm interested to see is anyone's gonna figure out the grab text in this video game. Oh, what? That, that was kind of a huge juggle opportunity there from Lance. Evened out a little bit. Oh, but okay, okay, okay. Galley. Actually, a fucking tie game. Theo charging in every time. Oh, a grab! Okay, grab from uh, Pop Gun. On the ground, makes it out, survives, gets hit by it. And Theo getting zoned out here a little bit by Lai evens it up. Breaking it down. Oh, hit with the a close range laser blast from Pop Gun, but I think yep, yep. that's yep. only round, round one. one. Only round one. Oh long. my god, Pop Gun just dancing around Theo a little bit here, but he gets some damage in the process. Theo's starting to figure out uh, his range, I feel like. Yeah, no, it's definitely a question because every character, this is a super zoning game. This game kind of reminds this is going to sound dumb. This game kind of reminds me of exclusively the part of Pokémon Fighters where you run around shooting memes at each it other. It actually reminds me of Pokémon a lot, because once you get close, you shift into a much more traditional Oh mode. my god, alright, big move from Theo. Oh, Theo, Theo stunning Pop Gun, not going to capitalize on it, because I don't think that's happened yet, and it's- Okay? Oh my what god! What the fuck is this? What, what is, is this? this? What is this? What the fuck was that? What was that? Theo did what something did just crazy! The massive geyser! Theo's barely taking any damage this round! Can Pop Gun bring it back? Pop Gun fighting! Oh! Waiting for it, waiting for it. Okay. Oh! Got the stun! A little hit there to capitalize on it, but not enough. And that's it. Pop Gun getting knocked down, that's not it! No, I mean, that's it for that round. It's going back to time. What the yeah, fuck was that? Yeah, bring it I back. It's a super. Yeah, it's. I think back, back, it's back. It's your super. I don't think character. that was a super. I think that was something else. It looked like a super to me. I love the big. It might have been one of the grabs. Oh, and speaking of. Wait. Oh my God, Theo gets a quick <gasps> grab. Giant geyser to pop gun there. From the missiles. And Theo is figuring out all of the zoning tools that I think Gally has as a character. Rushing in. Big missiles. Rushing in. Oh my god. Pop Gun Arcade stunned. A little bit of capitalization from Theo. Pop Gun just it's having a hard time yet. keeping up here with Gally's huge damage and kind of just general versatility. Um, Wait, stun. Okay, stun gets a little charge forward. To start in. Okay. That's the grab. Something going on there, evening things out. No rush in, waits for it. The ever retreating projectiles avoids the geyser. Pop Gun definitely playing more defensively here. I don't think that's a bad move, but those missiles, you gotta block those missiles. Those do so much damage. That's oh it. my god! The actual crazy little cross up there, I have too. A reason to win. We just straight up game in this piece. I that have a, a reason to win. That was a crazy set. You don't like, <laughs> I won't forget your dead? face! It's just dead? No way! Alright, Theo. Round one. Theo taking round one. I'm gonna allow you an, oppor uh, yep. an opportunity to character change, of course, if you uh -oh. do not want to stick with who you're playing as. Alright, we're bringing it back with Lai versus Galley again. Get set. Go! Alright, Pop got rushing in early with that little slash. The pressure with the shadow balls. There's the rush. Oh, oh that was a combo up. Just a little bit. A little bit. A little bit. And, and, and there's a little bit of capitalization going on on some of these like clear like yeah. launchers and stuff. The projectile play in this game is really neat because it's like finding out your like uh, Lai has a three hit, which will eat the first hit of Galley's bigger projectile, and then the second two will hit him. So if you can call that out, you can cash them with the three hit. Well. Goes for it, but doesn't oh, get but it. That's, that, no, that, so left, that left lie so wide open yeah. after that move. I'm noticing, too, what Popcorn Arcade's doing is a lot of... I think we're going to see it again. Yeah, that move 
is I think, I, think Lies, I think Lies forward attack, uh, which creates a lot of distance. That's one of his big things. He can create a ton of distance and knock people back and kind of zone them out that way. But uh, I'm not seeing all the that out of be it. Yeah. Nonchalantly punted to the ground. Oh my god. Theo just immediately getting in there with the fucking uh, those up closes. All right, creating some distance, doing a little bit of zoning there. Theo a waste blocking, it's a but... small reflex. Oh, the stun gets okay. one hit. One hit. You could get much worse off of that. Trying to punch real blocks, breaks the geyser. Waiting for it. Tries okay, to dancing just behind them a little more. bit. Oh, and the grab. Okay. Dude, the grabs this game are. Oh my so god! Cool. And creates a bunch of distance again. Forces their way back in. Yeah. That's long. huge. That's huge. That not hit by the geyser. Lies little iframe section there, so that was good for Popgun, the but Theo keeping it out almost exactly immediately and dashing right through Popgun. Oh my God! Grab. <laughs> Theo taking a slight lead here. Popgun, uh, assuming that defensive position again, making it that distance. This game is oh. really close. It's so much closer than it looks. No, it's, 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 it's coming all the way back. Oh my god! You the jumping attack! The tries to oh no, no but leaves Popgun wide open. Theo kind of evening it out again. Every time anyone going scratches out a lead, it feels like the next person. Oh and god. anyone who gets a lead, it just gets narrowed One out. One more hit will do it! Oh my god, dancing around him. Is around that it? No! Oh my god, is that it? The grab okay. Okay! Popgun's staying alive! Down to the wire here! For Popgun, this is a life or death round now. This is crazy. That oh my grab God, is that grab. so much work. That's just the light grab. I think you have multiple. There are a few grabs. There are a few grabs. And I think some moves you can charge. Yeah. I'm noticing one of Evil Zone's big mechanics is that you can charge. If you, you know, have a guy down on the ground or something, you can hold your attack button and you gain crystal energy. You charge your J.O. crystal, essentially. Yeah. Uh, and that can power up some of your moves. So notice I, this one, Popkin is taking advantage right now. Uh, kind of a, not an exact inverse, but really keeping it much closer than it was the last game. That these grabs are going so far! But things are just basically just even. Close for the overhead, but uh, Popkin's ready to react to it. Yeah, with that little headshot. Oh my god, the footsies for real, too. I, I did not notice the giant gamer sign at the back of the level. It's us! These, These grabs grab. are doing major work for Popgun. This is a huge part of the game hit. plan here. Oh my, god. oh my god, grabs him out of the launcher! This is huge! It feels like... <laughs> it's so cool seeing people figure out yeah. these fucking characters. Theo on the edge! Like oh. the zone. Theo gets the grab, Popgun. Another! Getting just grabbed over and over again here needs to kind of capitalize on something. Blocks it. Lies no, behind. Open. Nothing for it. Guards just in time. Can we bring this to a game three? It's so close. Here come the projectiles. A little bit of zoning. Oh my god, Popgun trying to get in. I don't. It's oh, no. one hit away. One hit away. Theo takes it. That was crazy. Staying alive and losers, that's it for Popgun Arcade, but a phenomenal set. I forgot to update the scoreboard. That's okay, that's okay. Theo. Theo moving ahead. That was crazy. That, but that's one of those two O's that was crazy close yeah, the whole was way crazy. through, man. That was crazy, crazy close. Can we get, get, get it out for fucking Popgun Arcade? That yeah, was, that was, like, game sick. That that's, was a sick Evil Zone set. I think in our playtesting, that was like top five games that were like, damn, this is kind of something. I think Evil Zone is an awesome game. I am a little bit sad that nobody played my man Disniver or whatever. Yeah, the that fucking... guy. That guy is sick as fuck. Yo, all caps, that game is fucking sick. True. All right. Well, that brings us back to the bracket. Oh. I'm gonna run to the restroom. Good move. Super I'm gonna... quick. Popgun, unfortunately, your run is over. Popgun, no, yes, Popgun, you were kind of killing it actually. That was a solid. Uh, that was a solid Evil Zone set. I like that. That was down to the wire, like every single round. I mean, Theo does get to move on. To the loser's bracket. Staying alive. I'm going to wait a second for Boot to come back. Because I can't Bye. say the gamer's prayer on my own, obviously. Oh.
Can we get to? Oh, is the prediction already live too? Jesus Christ! You're, yeah, you're, they are on top of us. these. All right. So, you ready? Moving into our uh, our, our pool. Pool set. S. Let the synth pool. Let me, let me set this up. Let me set this oh, up. I have to add all these people. <laughs> yeah, I was I was kind of surprised you had it. I've been meant to before I went to the bathroom, but I forgot. It's just like so invested in these matches, you know. Woo. <laughs> Let me grab Nail and Cool Dude. I think Aubrey will be right, right on the ready. So I'll be Nao as player one. Cool Dude P two. Yeah, Nao, you're gonna be player one for this first set. Cool Dude, you're gonna be player two. There's so much money on me. I am so scared. <laughs> Let's say the gamer's prayer. Let's say the gamer's prayer. Everybody all together. I swear before I spin this wheel, no drop of anger will I feel. No grains of salt course through my veins, no matter what may be my game. I'll take my hand and play it well, thus save me from a gamer's hell. I'll spin the wheel. I swear, I swear, I swear, I swear. Oh god, high number. This is an actually fucking badass one. This is extremely funny. What was the sound effect for that? <laughs> this old telephone ringing. Bring, 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 bring. This is a, an interesting one. I think this is the oldest fighting game in this list. No. Yes. Yes? Maybe? I don't think so. Yes, no, maybe? I think I no, know. but it's... <laughs> this is so fun. I love Joy Mech Fight. Joy Mech Fight's actually a fun-ass game. This is a directional input game. A couple of characters have quarter circles, I think. I think some characters have a quarter circle, but uh, a lot of it is very just directional battling. I was asked, where do you even find these? This, this guy is literally in Super Smash Bros. This guy's in Super Smash Bros. And also, this game is literally, like, on the Nintendo Switch, I think. You, you can play this game in English on your Switch. This is from 1983. Ah! <laughs> I'm skipping that. All right, sorry. Stop the Yay! He's so happy! Sukupon is a robot that was built to tell jokes. He's a robot comedian. All right, let's see this. This is going to be huge. I'm actually mad excited to see some Joy Mech fighting. <laughs> we're chilling, we're chilling. Who is this? Who is this one? Nao and Cool Dude. Nao and Cool Dude. So Cool Dude, no, playing, okay. Nao player actually, one, totally playing Boulder. We're seeing Boulders versus Orbs. I think that's Electric Balls. Okay, so, <laughs> electric orbs versus metal orbs. Who wins this fight? This is a tale as old as time. People are always talking about this exact Ooh. matchup. Dude, the jump-ins in this game are fucking crazy. Oh, dude, the spacing. And the spacing's so hard to judge. Yeah. Enjoy mech fight. You really, I think every character does have slightly different spacing, and, and you don't get, like, a limb to look at, so <laughs> you're just kind of trying Ooh, to fig yes. figure that out, you know? I love the way pink character, like, squiggles, dude. All right, all right. Go. There's the kick, punishes it. Yeah, there was a super. Oh, we're seeing Chun -Li. a Oh no, oh no. Let's go, cool Jump dude. <laughs> Oh no, Cool Dude's figured out two moves. And a fire. A fireball. Mayo's picked a character I don't think any moves. I've been figured out with Whoa, oh, that's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage on that move. I'm seeing the attempts at getting moves out too. I'm seeing that. Oh, okay. What the fuck is that? Headbutt. Charging headbutt. Round one goes to pink guy. Round one goes to pink guy. That <laughs> seems like... Pink guy seems to have just a really solid moveset yeah. overall compared to rock guy. Rock guy, I think, hits really heavy. If you rock guy, I think, has strong normals, but, like, do you see, like, pink guy one hit here is just doing so much. It's just that kick, dude. That, like, big multi-kick that they've got. I'm on the edge of my seat. Right I am too. Now. I'm actually invested. Will punish. Oh my god! And those jump-ins are so risky. Through. It's scary because you maintain your health after a loss. Wait, trying to wait out. It feels out like the, that move case. is so hard to capitalize on too. It leaves a giant field of damage in front of you, and it doesn't go away particularly fast, or it doesn't go away particularly slow. Oh my god! It just it, it shreds you, man. Yeah. Waiting for it. Here comes the kick. Punch through. 
I'm seeing good, like, fundies okay. as well as you can take do it. it. Take All right. the final round. I don't think you're winning this one, but it seems like... like oh, that's a little bit negative. No, just because look how little health you start with. You do start with very little health, and I think one big kick from yeah, Pink Guy... I think one kick right now ends it. ...takes that away, but... There goes the overhead. Oh, no. the, All right. There goes the kicks. Little bit there. Can it happen? Oh, going over it and missing it, and that goes game one. Game one goes to Cool Dude. No, it doesn't. Really? It's three! Oh, I didn't know! You get three health bars I didn't in know you there. get three health bars. Wait! But I think each health bar is a little bit smaller, maybe? No, I think it's just, like, these motherfuckers are strong. Whoa! Oh my god, command grab! <laughs> oh my god, command grab! I think that's just normal grab. I think it's just the normal grab. The grabs in this game are actually huge. That, that will change the dynamic completely now that people have figured those out. Like, I don't think Theo has a bad approach here, but no, this is a character not. that just feels really hard to, to get in on, you know? This, this, this if Theo takes this, takes this one, like, now, basically, then I think that they have a really good, like, opportunity to actually take this game, but it's gonna be rough. Because you gotta get through it. You just gotta get that heal. I can easily see a character switch here, too. Oh, definitely. I, I feel like Rock Guy has one move, and it feels like it just is hard countered by Pink Guy here. Oh, but body nice slam. getting with the body slam, bringing it down to the last health bar for both uh, for both okay. players. It's gonna be a lot to fight through fireball. I forgot. About oh my that. god! But the zoning. What do you even do about this, man? And that's it. That's it. Boom. All right, that is round one. Goes to cool dude. Let's see opportunity for a character switch here, though. Big opportunity. Oh. We got Pink Eyeball, we got Drill Bit. Okay. I almost want to, like, look up the movesets in this game just to see. No, I think that, uh... I, 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 I think bit. I think Boulder Boulder Rockman wasn't quite working out. I think that's a it, it's an iffy character for this uh, this purpose. The command grabs are like literally on deck. This game had the largest fighting game roster until KOF ninety eight. Yeah, because there's like a million secret characters. You can play as a bird somehow. Whoa! Whoa! Okay, that's something. And Bison? That's something. Did you find a charge character? <laughs> Is this a charge character? <laughs> Whoa! Wait, now we're on to something. All right, now drill, we're on to something. Drill has something going on here. This is a far more interesting character matchup. It feels like this is two characters that have at least some kind of tool. Oh no, but abusing it a little bit too much. Huge! Huge that, over, though. That, that mobility goes kind of yeah. crazy. <laughs> oh, it's a crazy anti-air kind of there, that way. That's... Oh! <laughs> the cross-ups on Drill Guy goes insane. Round one. Round one goes to Cool Dude, but that was also a lot of that was Neo feeling this character out, I think. Oh, that leaves you so vulnerable to that kick, though. They've got their own drill move, but you just gotta be ready to do it. Do the fucking. <laughs> it's a good move, but I, I definitely wouldn't overly rely on yeah, it. Yeah, because it, it just a, leaves you so open on that, him. That's put Nao in a really, uh, really risky spot here with the, uh, with the health management. You got a land that like super drill is just out of range. Down almost a full life here. Actually, that's a really good use. Just get out. The cross up is extremely useful. I just don't know how valid it actually is as an offensive tool in this game. It feels like it puts you, especially if you're fighting a character no! like a pink guy. No, wait, no, oh. they're pixel I thought, I thought it was over. I thought it was over. I thought it was over. Two whole health bars. It's gonna be rough, but it, it's possible. That low kick is really good. All right, nice, bringing nice. it back. Bringing it back a little it bit there. Down a full life, but I feel like Drillman can do. Drillman has a that's huge. That's that's a, that's a big move. That's a big move. But just the the, the straight up button mashing from Pink Guy is still alive. Here we go. Here we go. They're trading with these super punches, dude. Oh my god! I'm going for the kicks, but gets caught by the super punch. This is where that drill loop comes in, like when you see a jump in- Whoa! Punish down! Oh my there. god, I totally thought that was gonna be something, too. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Invulnerability frames in the fireball? 
again, you can still take this. It's just gonna be close. I and this is such a risky With the help, situation. You need to you need to you take need this almost now. perfect you need play. Stop, stop. Oh ladies and gentlemen, that's it, unfortunately, for cool dude Nao moving on. Well that's not true. Is that true? That's the opposite. That's the opposite of what happened. Huh? That's the opposite of what happened. What are you talking about? You need to keep track of our competitors. They, they, they swap sides. They, they swap sides. They swap sides. You do that all the time in a fighting game. Yeah, I know, but I was looking down. I have my notes. I have one on the right. Not one even the watching the matches. I think. Cool I think dude. they'll be fighting back through losers. I think it, it's very unsurprisingly. I think that that was. No, 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 the game game is cool, but dude, that that pink guy. Pink is... guy finding pink guy's moves is so huge. That pink guy might be the top tier in this game because that projectile <laughs> feels almost like impossible. No, to No, the overcome. projectile is fine. Projectile is nothing. It's the projectile. It's both of them. It's the projectile the was the huge tool there, and no one else seems to have a projectile that's that like fast. The projectile is so easy. <laughs> <laughs> well, it was a good showing. Fucking what's it called? The the guy with the spiky hair, Brown Bart. Uh, damn, I so, damn I supposed to do about that? Gamers prayer, gamers prayer, gamers prayer, gamers prayer. I'm actually, dude, we're getting so many good games. Dude, wait. Oh, it's so it's high numbers every time, dog. It's we're like it's gonna be like an all arcade. Game. <laughs> it's it's like not the worst fate in the world. No, that's fine. Chilling with that. I love this game. You're, you're gonna. You're in for a nightmare. Oh, you're in for. Shit, you're, you're in for a nightmare. I actually like this game. Oh fuck, dude. Oh shit, dude. Oh. Fuck. <laughs> Me and Queef really like this game. This is another one we had fun. I it's a play as one boy. Fun. I think this game is pretty fun. There's the controls. Is it Aubrey Cool dude? Yeah, Aubrey Cool dude. Ladies and gentlemen, Cardinal Sin for the PlayStation Two. Do you feel glad or unhappy as a competitor to draw like a weird fucking video game? It sucks. It sucks? <laughs> that is unfortunately the entire point. No! Oh. We're getting the Nephra. Alright, this is gonna be huge. This is a real ass video game. Boot and I had some competitive sets in Cardinal Sin. We, we got pretty good. I think this is like a direction plus button. All right, let's see how this goes. So Aubrey playing Nephra, Cool Dude playing McCree. Fighting it in. Getting close. So I will Aubrey say immediately. Hit. Ooh, launcher! Oh, okay. Didn't capitalize on with the Get juggles, the sword. Gets the sword. Aubrey has the glowing sword now. That's going to be a damage buff for a while. And you can see it already. Oh my god, Aubrey going crazy! One sidestep. Oh, but the little McCree, for help. McCree picked up a little bit. Oh my up, god! He's trapped in that little combo there. This is the, yeah, that yeah, was yeah. so fast. That was crazy. That was so fast. That's just the power of Nephra. So I am gonna say something. Uh -huh. I, 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 I am a commentator. I want to talk about these characters. Uh -huh. This is two low tiers. <laughs> McCreek sucks. I want to make. McCreek is a good move. I believe McCreek. McCreek has like one good move. Nephra relies heavily on her magic, but does have more like move set variety with her normals, and gets the magic. Gets the sword magic sword again. Again and manages to kill him off. That was so. Fast. That was so fucking fast. I. That's crazy. I'm not seeing any blocks. No, there were definitely blocks in there for both of them. It was just okay. opening through. It's because blocks a fucking button in this one. Are we gonna see a change? Yeah, changing characters. Really tempted by Stygian. You're not gonna you're not gonna go to <laughs> Hecklar? I... You're not gonna go to Hecklar's stage? Hecklar, oh. Is this their final matchup? It looks like it. Alright. <laughs> Aubrey with the lead. Random! Hecklar! Hecklar! Oh, no! No! no. So Hecklar is notably... Hecklar is the clown. ...a stage that sucks to go to. This is by far the worst stage in the game. I'm so sorry. And I also want to say, uh, Stygian... Begin. ...is the worst character in the video game. 
Christ! Jesus fucking Christ! Oh! oh I hate being on headphone stage! I hate being on here! Parry! Oh, the parry though! Wait a second! Parry into the wall! Cool thing is Sticky figuring some stuff out with Sticky in, actually. What the heck are buff, dude? Like, ultimately, a character being the Don't worst the in a game like Cardinal Sign doesn't amount to that much. Oh, and the shove! <laughs> cool around. figuring out the shove move, just pushing Aubrey around, maybe going for the staring gesture head in the middle of the ring. Nothing for it, Stygian wins! Kinda fucking swaggy walk. Kinda Stygian. swaggy walk. Stygian's kind of awesome. Who's, right. who's, oh no, Aubrey walking right into the spinning clown head, doing a little <laughs> bit of damage. <laughs> and knocking Nefra out of the air, Stygian kind of figured, like, it, it, it's interesting. This is, mm -hmm. Stygian's working a lot more for Cool Dude than McCreed was. Yeah, definitely. Uh, despite kind of objectively being a character with problems. Some of the biggest uh, drawbacks in Cardinal City. Bouncing off the wall. Oh, oh he injured the, the magic sword! sword. sword. Aubrey got it. This worked out. The swap. This is an exact reversal of what happened. What are you looking at? It's St it's St it's Stygian. It's Stygian. It's Stygian on Hecklar's house. Oh my god! Even out one and one. Are they gonna stick with these characters? It seems like Aubrey is. Remember not to go random again. <laughs> Play. This game is the coolest shit ever. Bring this game back. It seems like a good one. I right, go into random plague stage. I don't remember what plague I stage. I know who plague is. Like. Is this the swamp? This game needs stage counterpicking. Oh no! I think that's poison. I think if you touch that, you get hurt. That, that is poison. All right, let's see what happens here. Aubrey, the little opening goes for the shove. Nothing for it. A little bit. What the fuck was that? I don't know, but... Did it did a ton of damage. A little bit more Tracy's well, here than we've seen in most of our uh, rounds so far. It is a pretty Launcher? Wide open. Goes, oh, goes for the follow-up. Goes for the follow-up. Goes for the follow-up. Aubrey taking a narrow lead here. Flash? Parry from oh, Cool Dude. Into the poison! Getting Aubrey into the poison lane. And this is a dangerous territory these two are playing in now. Aubrey's in a dicey little zone right next to the poison. Oh no, Aubrey's poison! You're taking slow poison damage. Aubrey I think that's it. Oh, Aubrey losing round one to getting backed into the poison swamp. That was so close, though. <laughs> Alright, what's gonna go on here? Big overhead, Ooh, big overhead first opener. Hit with the big overhead, jumping overhead. Aubrey kind of capitalizing on some of the air game in this game, which is unusual. You don't see it that often. Yeah, you know, some people try it. The shove is so funny. Oh, but a full that combo! That was crazy. That was like a 50% combo from Cool Dude. Aubrey keeping it in though, mixing up really well. Oh, with the parry. parry oh, they were going for the parries. How much damage off of that? don't do that much damage. It's just like a get off and gets you out of a combo. It gets you out of a bad situation. No and you can kind of follow up with it. And Aubrey with the Mr. parry, no follow up. Oh, the magic sword. sword. Aubrey needs to no, get. No, not the parry. Aubrey needs to take care of Cool Dude before the magic sword can come into play because that's, that's so much one damage. More one more hit, hit will do it. Gone. Oh my God. That's it! Aubrey takes it! Alright! One more, one more! Even now, this is a to the wire situation is this our, once is again. This is our first, like, game three? Begin. This is game three. Game final three, round. match point. Somebody is gonna be moving on to the winner's bracket and somebody's gonna go fighting, uh, someone's gonna go fight Mayo. Aubrey at the opening. Aubrey taking a pretty commanding Big combo! Here. Aubrey found a move! Aubrey found a move! Uh, Aubrey bring it to the point! <laughs> Aubrey found a move back in Cool Dude into, into the poison. poison! Into the poison! Cool Dude's gonna need a death! Man, so poison! Poison to death! Poison to death! I guess! In a straight I push guess into cool the poison! Dude die. Cool <laughs> Dude gets poisoned to death in the swamps! <laughs> the skeleton man kind of just stood there and, and, and didn't like fall down or anything. He was kind of like. No animation for poison <laughs> KO. No animation for poison KO. It just kind of ends. Aubrey moving on! That was a that was a competitive. That's game. a really it's good set. Game. Really good set. And you know what this means? It's the run back, baby. Oh man, that's true. Mayo, cool dude. Aubrey moving on to winners and cool dude. Gonna have a rematch with Mayo. I swear before, before I spin, spin this wheel, no drop of anger will I feel, no grains of salt course through my veins, no matter what may be my game, I'll take my hand and play it well, thus save me from the gamer's hell. 
Let's spin Game the wheel. In. We are rapidly running out of the entire PS1 library I had, which is very funny. It's really funny because this means the back half of tournament is going to be relatively traditional. Ooh, Low game. Right Low game. Seven. Lucky number seven. I hope this is a good game. I hope Mayo gets a good game for the birthday. Oh! Okay, okay, I'll rock with it. I'll rock this with is, it. All right, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I need to remember the full name for this video game. By the way, that game played like ass. If you're wondering, <laughs> no, it's fun. It's actually fun. No, it plays <laughs> like shit, but it's also kind of fun. That's, <laughs> that's what it comes down to. Because new man character super tag battle for the Neo Geo console. All right, so we are getting our button check mashup. I'm actually so excited for this game. I, I've had a lot of fun with this one. I was playing Master Roshi too. All right, so what's his face? I don't remember his name, but Gozu, I think, has like a, some... Gozu has crazy range. That's his big thing. This, this is a stripped zoner versus kind of a weird matchup. Master Roshi, which I think we Whoa, actually are about gone. to see, he gets mad when he's at half health. Oh yeah, so you have, you have two moves. moves. You have a red, a red one and a yellow one. You probably want to swap your character at this point. But push it on it, push it on it. Master okay. Roshi does get extra tools when he is in his rage mode. Master Roshi committing in rage mode right now. Oh, but now the tag, swapping out tag to for a uh, whatever her name is. And Cool Dude's in the corner with Master Roshi. Is he just oh, going for as much extra credit as possible? Is he? Oh! That's KO. That's KO! Was this the one that we decided was first to five? I think we were talking about how it would be first to three because you technically yeah, have a yeah. bunch of health bars. But Cool Dude did not switch to, uh... So that's Neo's game. If we're doing first to three... I think it's first to three. I think it's only fair. The, the change was on the table. It was right there, ready to go. A, a, attempt to try and capitalize more almost got the kill, but that last minute tag saved them. Yeah, that that, 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 that a tag was much needed in that situation because King Leo, he's a good character. He's a good character, and he could have made a huge difference in that fight. Neo's team just has a lot of range on Cool yeah. Dude's team right now. That's big. Projectile. All right. Trying to space it. I think, yeah, I saw Neo, Neo trying to get that tornado move out, but some of the insults Sidekick. in this game are a little bit awkward. Yes, the oh, that's a great solid. Spot. Huge advantage here. Master Roshi about to be in angry mode. Master Roshi in angry mode, but trying the question to is, is Cool Dude... Backing and tagging right. out. Cool Dude tagging out for King, King Neo, Neo, and now Neo's in a risky situation with the almost Backing bad out. Gozu. Swapping in. Tagging out for Rosa, I think. Are getting gutted by King Lion. Right King now. Lion with some really crazy tools here. Mad rushdown. I see Corner. Neo trying to trying to download what's going on with this character. Projectile. Right, the tool there. That's that's big. That's big. Pushing it's in, not pushing, impossible. Pushing a Neo bit. might want to switch out here because one of those big combos. One pick. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and that was to the wire. <laughs> oh my god. All right. All right, Neo Cool Dude. This is it. All right, now we're going to see Neo stick with the same team. Oh, can I... I guess I, I I haven't updated the graphic at all. I haven't updated the score. It's yeah, one we, and we one. Can, we can scroll out and update that real quick. Let me do that. Let me do that. Let me do that. This is crazy. This could be literally anything. Starting with Rosa. Ninja on the back. I mean, Mayo and Cool Dude both seem to have these characters kind yeah, of working have, for it. But... We'll start here. Waiting for it. Oh, that was something. I'm seeing that 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 last that last round trying to figure some more inputs out and stuff. May with Cool Dude in the corner, but Cool Dude fighting out pretty fighting commandingly with yeah. Master Roshi. Oh, dodges oh, the DP. Whips. 
Double tag! Oh, double tag! Play. They are gaming right now! Big Lion looking spicy, dude. That corner combo. That corner is combo. This is a scary situation to be in, but but fighting through. especially with a zoning game Rosa. character like uh, like. Rosa. I think the Rosa pick is actually like a little bit. Easy. I think that being able to outrange this guy seems to be the way that you can really deal with them. So, but Cool Dude's lurking in that tag zone, and Mayo's being kept out of its tag zone. Mayo's gotta get through now. Mayo, the tag, the swap, and the punish. And that's first to three, you think? That's first to three. Oh. Oh, man. That's a close one. That's a really close one, man. That's crazy. All right. Well, I guess that's pool. That's that pool. That's the pool, way. dude. Pool S. A real wild card one. That game's kind of fucking tight, man. Like, for real. We oh. was playing. We, you've been playing Ninja in that game. Who was I playing? I was playing the same character Neo was playing, actually, uh -huh. who is cool. No, you were playing Ninja. I don't know who the fuck he was doing. I was playing the other... The, the, there's the red Ninja and the other Ninja. <laughs> Neo was playing the other Ninja, and I was just doing Ninja Duo. And the little... The, the red Ninja is awesome. I never got the hang of the one that Neo was playing. I think he's kind of a weirder character, but... No, a good set from Neo and Cool Dude. Great an set. actual, like, a cool game video three. game. I think cool that the, the tag mechanic in that game is so neat. We'll do though moving on to losers bracket nail out with a wonderful fun run nail out with a good run thank you for participating nail again I, every I, single I, one of I you am... is wonderful <laughs> those were some real ass sets i want to play the game want to say the gamers let's prayer. do it <clears throat> we need a gamer's prayer after this one i swear before i spin this wheel no, no drop, drop of, of anger, anger will i feel no, no grains of salt course through my veins and no, no matter what may be my game i'll take, I'll take my hand and play it well and save me from a gamer's, gamer's hell amen amen <laughs> we roll the spinner it's so crazy watching the spinner get this small this fast 11? Oh. What's 11? Ah! Oh, man. Tia and Carmella. I have some news for you. What? You're playing Survival Arts. Is that is this the one I think it is? Yep. No! You are playing no! Survival Arts, my friends! Here we go. I think this is, this this should be for real now. Yeah, like, this you, is the real one. This I believe you one. are competing at this point. So, Mongo Gunner. All right, Mongo Gunner. <laughs> Jesus, for the fucking chip damage though. All right, all right, all right. Back to the mix. Back to what the, the fuck what was that? What is? What the fuck? What Mongo? <laughs> what was that? Is it weird that Gunner is not the gun guy? Is it just a flashbang that blinds everybody? It's not good for anyone. <laughs> the idea of us spending this time to get this fucking game working. Maybe I should have just let this one. Uh, maybe I should have just forfeited this and moved on to a different game. Block this. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Oh my god. Okay, so I'm gonna stop with the fucking flash. I'm gonna fix something here. Okay, okay, Carmella kind of getting in there with the gunner's neutrals. Um, there's the counter. The flash stick doesn't even do anything. It's not an attack. It's just the flash. Oh my god! All right, this is really close. <laughs> Last one, last one for, for round number one. Oh wait, Gunner does have a gun, I was wrong. Carmella taking a little lead. Gunner does have a gun. That is why he's called Gunner. It shoots fire out what of his the pistol. Fuck was that? Okay, I'm using this big fucking angel. What throwing strike! What the fuck My happened? God. That was so much damage to Gunner from something. I didn't even really see what happened. And Mongo taking 
Round Tia one. Yeah, Tia takes round one after after much ado. After Tia much takes ado. it back. <laughs> With a with a with a close <laughs> victory Do you in round one. Uh, let, me, let me update the score. Let me update the score. Hold oh on. my god! All right, Tia taking Tia round taking one. <laughs> all right, uh, Carmella moving Jesus back to Viper, Christ. the solid all-rounder of this game. Oh, he has a slide. Oh, it's, oh, it's over! It's over! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> this is a difficult strategy to counter. <laughs> Can I say something? <laughs> what? What? Boot was trying to play this game's arcade mode <laughs> as Viper, <laughs> and the first game. opponent in the arcade mode is Mongo, and this is exactly what Boot did to win. <laughs> this is exactly what he did. He found the slide kick button and pressed it over and over and over again. <laughs> I'm supposed to be commenting. I'm supposed to be commenting. <laughs> Tia clutching out that first round versus Viper overcoming Carmella's menacing, <laughs> uh, menacing slide kick Boom. technique and finds uh, Mongo's famous taser gun. Mongo, if you were unaware, by far has the most inputs in the game. Mongo has twice the moves that everybody else has. The fucking drone strike, dude! Drone strike's a difficult one to counter, but Carmella actually doing a pretty good job Carmella of avoiding pretty it. pretty good. One more hit will do it! Oh, and nice! Tie game, tie game. <laughs> gets Tia in the corner and knocks Mongo out with a little... I think that was a slide kick. I think that was a slide kick. The slide kick might be Viper's it's best move. definitely the move that's most central to Viper's <laughs> moveset, and a huge aerial from... Carmella to start off this last round. I'm trying to think about how the fuck you get out of the- This is make or break. Dude, Carmella is actually maybe kind of cracked with Viper. I'm seeing some the... insane strategies get busted out here. The overwhelming- I don't know combat. how you punish it, dude. Okay, drone strike, Mongo. you gotta go for the drone strike now. Oh. Tia making good use Whoa! of her normals, but Carmella, Carmella with, with the, the dive train. kick. Right to my player two head. survived. <laughs> okay, that evens it out. It's Tia one and Carmella one, and an actually very close set in survival arts. <laughs> this was so worth it. It's not even funny, dude. And stick it. Are we sticking with the same characters? Let's That's see. what I'm wondering. Because Viper, Viper seemed to do a pretty good job for Carmella, especially compared to Gunner. Here we go. Viper and Mongo in the underwater chamber that is bobbing. Guns up and are down. on the floor. I repeat, guns are on the floor. Will I... anybody use them? Items were not turned off for this competitive game. <laughs> flash kick. And busting out the flashbang. I keep saying fucking flash kick because it's a real move. Which does not seem to do anything. Drone strike. The drone the strike. The bomb. Which annihilates Carmella's health you bar. The and fills it up before Carmella could get off the ground. <laughs> Mongo's famous nuke move. I think that Mongo might be one of the funniest characters in any fighting game, like, by far, dude. I like that no one's even trying to figure out what the pistols on the ground do. Yeah, because it's just fucking like slide kicking. Which is from awesome! Them. That's, that's half of Carmella's health bar gone. Boom, 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 boom! Carmella's doing a really good job of avoiding this move, yeah. though. Uh, honestly. I don't know how. I don't know how you avoided that last bomb drum strike. Dude, Carmella! Here we go, Tia. What? This is drop drop bombs, drop bombs. That'll do it. Oh <laughs> Tia my God. takes it with the drone strike jump. That is We gotta see the wind quote, Beep. You gotta, you gotta oh, the wind uh, quote. Let's, let's see the wind quote. Let's see the wind quote. <laughs> There's no wind quote. I think that's it. Is that it? Is there Unless, I don't know what happens after there. Tia wins it <laughs> after much ado. <laughs> with... No, it doesn't have a wind quote. Easily the funniest character I've ever seen in a fighting game so far. But a close match, kind of a uh, kind of down to uh, that's a, insane. A solid one and two there. Uh, Carmella pretty, <laughs> pretty cracked with the Viper, but Mongo's famous drone strike is just a really hard attack to overcome. Good job to both competitors there. I'm glad that we got stuff figured out. I'm assuming that was fine. I'm assuming that was as fine as playing survival arts could be. I'm so happy for that so far. Taylor versus Tia matchup. The Tyler Tia matchup might be crazy. <clears throat> All right. Well, before we figure out what Tyler and Tia are going to be playing in their exciting matchup, let's say the gamer's prayer. I swear. 
before I spin this wheel. No drop of anger will I feel. No grains of salt course through my veins. No matter what may be my game, I'll take my hand and play it well. Thus save me from a gamer's hell. Game in. Oh my god. <clears throat> I'm gonna have commentator voice tomorrow, dude. No, I'm so excited to have some commentator voice. Looking forward to it, actually. Let me spin the wheel. Down to the last couple of games. Mm -hmm. This is maybe the most exciting thing in the world. There's actually a specific game I really want to show up, and it is... 13! Tyler Tio, seemingly an arcade game. I don't know if we have any PS1 ones left. No, we have a couple. We have a couple. <gasps> Whoa! Whoa! Dude. This might be the best case scenario. Like, actually. This is, and this is not unlucky 13. This is extremely lucky 13. This is the tie stream matchup. I'm I'm very excited. Classic friends, Tyler and Tia, stream together all the time. They're playing Waku Waku Seven, baby. <clears throat> Waku Waku Seven goes fucking crazy. I love Waku, dude. This is gonna be so. Oh, is this game. a real one? Oh, yeah, this no. is a real game. <laughs> this is a real ass game, and the controls are actually really playable. A lot like that last one was fucked. This one's something, dude. All right, so Tia stick with Tessie. Tessie, this is such a Tyler character. Maru. Okay, here we go. Here we go. All right, Tyler and Maru. This is our button check. I'm also gonna probably turn the game down a little bit because survival yeah. arts was definitely loud, and uh, are definitely uh, what's the opposite of definitely? Maybe he was really good because it was so quiet. Whenever you're done testing your buttons, just crouch and stuff, you know. This game sprite art goes so crazy. It's actually so cool. This game's all gimmick. <laughs> Good? I need water. Did you just chug that entire water? That was like three matches ago. Uh, the whole game's little gimmick is everyone's like an anime trope parody from a point where anime trope parodies were like cute and fun and not like... Disgusting. <laughs> Alright, I think that we're done here. I think that- I think that we're good here. Alright. Oh, man. I'm actually really excited for this one. For you two to get a real fighting game, it feels like it had to happen. Alrighty, let's see this. Tia versus Tyler. Who's gonna come out on top in Waka Waka Splash 7? Waku Waku 7, sorry. Alright. Here we go. Power approaching. Oh, that fucking Thunderbolt. Whoa! Yeah, I, this feels like it's a hard matchup for, for Maru a little yeah, bit. Yeah, for like a little big boy. Maru, I, I, T Tessie has some weird like zoning yeah. tools, I, I believe. When I was way testing through. this one, Tessie seems like a really interesting character. And yeah, Maru seems like he has a hard time getting in. So, <laughs> I'm not Trying sure to... how this is going to go for Tyler, but I'm hoping that yeah. it just stays competitive, you know? It looks like Tyler's trying to fight in with those, like, big normals, but you're not getting a ton off of it. And Tyler's keeping Whoa! it pretty even, though Wait, Tyler taking a Super lead on Tia here, here. Yeah, but whipping that him. big move there. You needed it. And, oh, narrowly avoiding Tessie's oh! <laughs> scary lightning bolt attack, but eating a bunch of random objects in return. Oh. <laughs> Random object. Look out for the wiener dog. Full screen. Careful. Tyler's just getting wait, going I thought, wait, here. Wait, is her is her a deal that you can like charge a million shits? I think you can just charge and get a bunch of random items that you throw out. That's so like actually fucking cool. But Tyler, Tyler poking with these big meaty paws, slowly getting pushed away. There's the landing. It's fucking cool. Tyler prioritizing some neutral <laughs> gameplay here. Nice little punch through. Get it through. Man, on Tia there, but not with that. Entering super mode. Uh, not the not is, the worst spot you could have. Is he gonna be able to capitalize? No, off definitely of it? not. Not really. And Here now there's the gonna objects. be some big crap coming out from Tia. Oh no! Here come the bombs. This is just a hard game plan for I think Mario to play yeah. around. Getting in! Alright, getting in there, can Tyler pull it back? 
Here comes, here comes an object. It's not impossible, but Tia busting out yep, the yep, yep. No way, no way. Sneaking right in there and taking round one of Waku Waku 7. I think that, like, vibe-wise, this is one of my favorite games. I think this is top three in Huibo, like, as in terms of just, like, really cool games. All right. Woo! Yeah, we accidentally gave Tia a game that she's just good at. <laughs> All right. It's a good game. It's so cool. Running it back with Running Maru. Back right away. Oh, the skipping the dial. I don't, we don't think, even care. I don't think that that was as uh, bad as it as No, it, 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 that, that was relatively closer. close. I think that was not that bad. Yeah. It was not that bad as an understatement. I think that was a solid showing from Tyler. Tyler is definitely like... Maru is being able to have oh the neutral gameplay here, but... Just getting past that wall of projectiles that Tessie can put up is so hard for, I think, the character Mario. Like, it goes from all angles, too. Oh, and Tyler is stunned! But Tia not quite capitalizing on it. However, is Tyler gonna be able to get in there? The fact you can hit them is so, like, big. Whoa, big uppercut! I right, got Tessie in the corner. The for it. No! Oh, but with ah! Ah! So close, I think that hit- That, that might have been it. I think that hit might have been it. To be close. Just attack. I like Tyler's strategy, but you're just getting hit so heavy by this. I'm doing super mode so early, that's so rough. You're knocked all the way back, pots and pans, waiting for it. Blocks, blocks, blocks. I 100% thought that the cactus was going to be another like, It cool. feels like they're... Like, I, I, Dude, I, I think the shit gone. I'm having such a hard time even seeing how you get in on, on this, like, just move that Tessie has. That might be it. Tyler with the little uh, punch, Tyler, though. Tyler, 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 life. Tyler Maru's big with one... <laughs> no. Oomph. You made a little girl cry on her little Totoro, dude. Actually, a little boy. Is it? Yeah. I know that. Are you getting angry with me by any chance? <laughs> I think that if the answer is yes, it's it's a fair answer. That was that the rough pickings. Well, Tyler, maybe you'll get better luck next time. Tia, moving on. Tia, moving on to winners. Bracket looking kind of crazy. This will decide our last slot. Uh, before top eight, I think, right? But Tyler not out yet, going down to take on Carmella for our last match of the Noel pool. He uh, says the funniest thing would be if there was just like one real game in there. That was a pretty real game. <clears throat> Let's all hold our hands together and say the gamer's prayer, okay? I swear before, before I spin, spin this wheel, wheel no drop of anger will I feel, no, no grains of salt course through my veins, no matter what may be my game, I'll take my hand and play it well, thus save me from a gamer's hell. Let's spin that fucking wheel, Carmella and Tyler, you're gonna be playing something interesting, I hope. We're getting the exclusively interesting ones now, I think. There's maybe like a couple stinkers Please in there. Please tell me this is the one that I want it to be. 15? Oh, There's wait. one game on wait. the list I distinctly wanted to make Tyler play, and I'm hoping this is it. This is number 15. 15, I think this might be it. To the PS1 game. Yeah. This is... Yeah! That's that's so immense. Dude, I'm fucking this popping is off. This is, style game. this is a game that I... I... Ooh, I want to just see gameplay of this game, honestly. I've been looking forward to seeing people play this one. I like the yeah, I know this game. This is one I expected people to, to know. I'm so excited for this one. Good. We're about to get fucking slap happy. It's time for slap happy rhythm busters. If you've not seen this, this game's fucking awesome. I really like this one. Alright, I'm gonna give you two controls. This is another game with good control. Since saying all caps, what? Synth, this is such a you video game. If you were to play a fighting game, Synth, I think this would probably be the one. Dude, this intro, I love the fucking soundtrack to this game, too. That was this game's own style fuck. This feels like a, this feels like a Noel-style game, too. Aw, uh, I'm just kind of watching the intro, like, yay! Did it do Metro? Is that a different one? Is that a different one? 
Is that Y2K? <laughs> is that Y2K? Let's run it. April's really fun. April is a very fun character who I really like in this game. I always am hesitant to say too much about the characters during the actual matches. I made tons of notes on the entire rosters of all these games. I play tested them all so thoroughly. And now that I'm streaming, I'm like, I kind of want it to be a surprise. <laughs> all right, all right. So, <laughs> Tyler, Tyler! Dude. Nice. All right. Nice response from Carmelo. Nice, nice response to the fucking. <laughs> nice Mello. response to the fucking scooting Mallow. <laughs> Mallow. <laughs> All right. So the shotgun doesn't actually have that much range. range. I think it is. Uh, Whoa! I. Burned a super for that, but kind of a confusing move there. I wonder what Tyler's strategy here is. <laughs> I think Tyler's strategy might be to do that little kick the entire time. <laughs> and I do think that this is going to get punished to fuck any moment now. But Carmella's kind of locked in the corner by it for now. There's no way. This is maybe the most evil thing I've ever fucking seen, dude. I I'm going to have to ban this kind of conduct. Oh my god. What are you doing, man? Yeah, boo. People are booing you. Boo! <laughs> this is going in allegations, man. This is... <laughs> <laughs> okay, what? That didn't connect. I think he was blocking. Dude, that move is so cool. There are a couple of moves that are really central to what April and Frosty both want to do. Uh -huh. Um... Uh... And I'm hoping to see some of them, because April can bust out some crazy shit. Oh yeah, that for Frosty's Ray Gun is pretty good. Oh shit. Oh, I'm like shit. watching this. Oh. Oh! I think Carmella Winner. needed to get that projectile out. Well, look at... Anyone who's watching the VOD, the expression that Frosty makes at the end there. All right, hold on. Let me. All right, so that's round one to Tyler. Round one to Tyler. Perhaps via some partially disrespectful some memes. Disrespect. A little bit. Of I disrespect. think there's a lot you could have done to stop that. Yeah. But at the same time, it's this like, come game, on. I will in, say, in a random bracket. I will say this. Them? This game has some moves that have whack recovery when you get hit by them. Um, there, there, I, I there are the same thing to you, and you just sort of end it. But I also figured out a move that I haven't seen. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Frosty's sitting in the corner, just kind of idling, like, happy with his knife. <laughs> Boom! Whoa! Careful! 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 Whoa! 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 God, somebody pressed some fucking buttons on my keyboard and opened my NVIDIA GeForce screen capture software. What is happening, dude? I think someone might have paused game. Okay. Somebody's getting a bit too ambitious with their button presses <laughs> and is like fucking up things on my computer. Please be careful. <laughs> I'm, I'm rooting for fucking Carmelo, dude. Wrap this shit up. Send this oh, guy I'm, seeing, I'm, seeing, I'm seeing some stuff from Frosty now, though. Right? Frosty's cooking. Tired and needed to Oh, shit. All right, hold on. Carmella just busted out one of the huge. I saw the fucking daggers get thrown out, too. That's big. Carmella and Tyler are both passively discovering the sets. That's in the corner. Carmella set, with the corner. Boom. The daggers are so big. That swinging shotgun move is good, but it leaves you so vulnerable to it. That that, that's really one of its things. You the shotgun out of it, right? Like, once, you're, once you, you're on the rooftop. I think you can cancel it. You need someone to use a super? <laughs> I kind of agree. It's on the thing. I think it's just a uh, he uh, heavy punch, heavy kick together. Not close match. April. Oh, okay, hold on. Okay. All right, Tyler with the super gets the bust move, I think. It's called, these are called, like, buster moves or something yeah. like that. Oh my god, oh my god! Missing a ton of it, though. It's so good. All of these have insane, weird rhythm game timing that, yeah. like, doesn't quite feel right sometimes, and I don't think the parset gameplay helps. It's, like, really, really tight. Yeah, the, the, okay, the timing for those is so tight. Tournament life for Carmella. Carmella seems to be figuring shit out. 
No, Tyler and Carmelo both coming in with more of a real Tyler's starting the game. Carmelo kind of playing keep away, and Tyler desperately trying to get in there, which is very reminiscent of Tyler's last game. Whoa, 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 whoa! Uh, please be careful. There's like crazy things being opened on my computer I've never seen before. Alright. That move's kind of crazy. The close up. Carmella fighting for everything. I, I this isn't the evil name. This is this is just buttons being pressed on my computer. I don't yeah. know who's pausing. Going for the DPS. I don't think it's invincible. I don't think it's fast enough. Try trying to abuse it like Tyler was abusing the low kicks, but it's just not as strong a move. It's not approaching. Oh my god! But that's oh! such a vulnerable yeah, move. It's a terrible winner. place. And Tyler moves on through the loser's bracket. That wound up a pretty real ass set, dude. That was tight. Whew. No, that was a good showing for Bella. Bella mad competitive in both games, and I think a pretty strong pool overall. No, I think that's probably the deadliest pool that we have. You can that, Tyler in the bracket. That was a deadly pool with a. I was gonna say a lot of real fucking video games in it, and then I remembered Survival Arts was there. Too. Survival Arts got close though. Once and maybe that one like wasn't it. very real. Great showing from Carmella. I, you were this fucking close to taking it. You like how the screws are written games? It's, it's such. I think that one's another really fun game, actually. So that gives us top eight. This is functionally the halfway point. Bit past it for the screen. This means that we have just about ten games left. Yeah, we are. I can count how many games we have left straight up. It is 10. So we are rapidly approaching that point, dude. The super move really hit you off guard. It's so shocking if you don't expect that to be yeah. the way that super moves work in that game. Even though I don't think it did that much damage because that has to be the hardest thing in the world to nail over per set. It did a lot. It still did pretty decent. So are we starting with Cinna and Thea? Yeah, yeah, they're numbered now. All right. Cynthia, let me let's go over who's in top eight first one. That's kind of big. Yeah, top eight. Winner side. Hard night. Hard night. Mockroach. Huge. Our our invitees uh, really showing their stuff. You're also colorblind, so you didn't see oh, that no. thing again. No. Oh. Aubrey and Tia. Aubrey is the only guest who made it out through through winners. This is actually really true. That's crazy. Aubrey Tia is gonna be scary. Aubrey's. Is that Sheep Gaming? That's Sheep Gaming. Sheep Gaming is That's coming. That's Sheepy Sheep Gaming about to happen in round four. Sheepy Sweep. This confirms a Sheep in uh, top four. Brown. Senna and Theo. Great matchup. Theo once again staying alive. Tyler staying alive. And that's against Cool Dude, who showed a ton of gameplay in that whole, whole situation. Yeah. It's a Neo Geo game. You know it's Neo Geo game when you get when the you scary green, green scary intro. Thing. It's Karnov's Revenge. Turning the volume down a bit, too. I think it's still fucked from survival arts. Alright, Theo, get in here. There you are, baby. The amount of people <laughs> saying, I love this game, is Dude, so people funny. people love this game? People Seriously? love Karnov. <laughs> That's shocking to me. People love the big fucking balloon man from Karnov, dude. Karnov, you mean? Is that Karnov? Yeah. Really? Yeah. I didn't know that was Karnov. Yeah, that's Karnov. Oh, the surprise of Karnov. So, first, Zazzy. Zazzy. So, wow. Zazzy's kind of chill. Zazzy is, I think, one of the better characters in this game. I'm pretty limited on my Karnov knowledge. So, Zazzy is Theo, Clown is. Cinna. Cinna. Yeah. Alright, so, let's Did see what's going on. Did in one of the last games? Did Cinna? No, me? Did Cinna? I think so. Oh, I think okay. Cinna played Hold on. earlier one. Theo figuring out a move, and I don't know if Cinna's figured out any no, move yet. quite yet. And yeah, there are weak points in Wait. this game. That's a cool thing about this game. So right now, Theo's headband is Zazzy's weak point, and Clown's mask is his weak point. If you hit those areas, I think, three what? times, they pop off, and they make it so that more damage is done. What the fuck? <laughs> Alright. <laughs> So now, I think 50% extra damage is dealt to Tom Ted. Doom, doom, doom. Oh my god. <laughs> Zazzy Platinum.
That's crazy. As he calmed down. Well, that only takes round one, though. We're on to round two. Let's see if Cinda can figure some stuff out. I don't know if I've seen any of Clown's moves come out. Um, Clown has really weird inputs for this game, I think. Zazzy has very oh traditional God. inputs. Dude, that Zazzy 100 hand slap is crazy. It's, it doesn't even do that much. It might be. What? <laughs> it's not overcome. It's not impossible to overcome. But it's the like, same grab. It's the same grab from the other What player. the hell was going on with clowns and games, man? They're all the same. It was in the first game that we played. That was an alien challenge. An alien challenge. The same fucking clown grab. All right. Theo just. Doing a pretty effective keep it's out actually, game here. It's hard to do a lot about this. No, it's actually pretty easy to deal with. It feels like there's like no priority. It's pretty easy to deal with. Uh, punches just seem to go right through it, honestly. Yeah. But it still just has a certain aura. Getting the opening though. Damn, Zazzy. Zarsh. <laughs> oh, that's the taking uh, round. Ew. That's the taking round one. <laughs> A warrior well, let's not get ready in the same for a room. new rival. Alright, is Cinna gonna stick with Clown or move on to somebody different? I think attempting something different. I think that's the play. It looks like they're the options are being weighed here. Wow. Really? Oh, no, back to the clown. Back to clown. Round one. I mean oh, Red Cloud awesome. might be the different maker. Red Clown very it. well may be what Red changes player. the game for Sinna here. Oh, that's- I, I feel- okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Putting in a little bit of work there. Oh! I saw Sinna just found a projectile. That's massive. That is massive. That could really, really change things up. Red Clown very well may be the difference maker. And the grab's nice. I'm almost afraid to stay that close to Zazzy in a situation like that, especially if you found out you have a zoning tool. I feel like you want to keep this guy out. The owl like beak and clown's mask? That was a really close one. Yeah, Theo scratching it out on that round one, but that was a lot closer than the other clown versus Zazzy mask. Is Theo just so cracked far. at this game? Is Theo really? Is, is Theo a Zazzy man? There's no way he fucking knew. Like, they, there's no way that they had any idea. The thing I'm noticing here that is really bad for Cinna is Zazzy's just punches hit Clown's weak point every time. Uh -huh. And once Clown's weak point is broken, Clown is taking an extra 50% damage every time he gets punched or there kicked in the face. And it's so easy to punch or kick him in the face. It lost Look everything! At the, yeah, like, that's everything. the thing. Without the mask, he's just in a really, really dangerous situation. Down to pixels. Here comes that fucking hundred hand One push, hit dude. and it's over. That's it! With a clean sweep with Zazzy's powerful fucking million hand punch. The freaky tiger Zazzy wins it. Zazzy's billions and millions of hands. And ladies and gentlemen, that's one down from the tournament. Gersh. <laughs> kind of crazy. Karnov a real ass game, dude. Karnov more real than I thought it was. Good job to both competitors for real. Good job to both competitors, yeah. Thank you, Cinna, for competing. But you can move Theo down to round five, either side. I know. But Theo is gonna move on to round five. Uh -huh. Moving on to round two. Cool dude sixty nine versus Tyler. Zazzy is in fact apparently top tier. Yeah, I I did know that. I I, I looked very thoroughly into what Karnov's Revenge's deal was, and Zazzy is like really good. Zazzy and the Zangief fan and the Zangief like are both super super crazy good, and it's funny that those are the two characters that Theo gravitated to immediately. I think just incidentally. We can start finding this. I swear before I spin the wheel. No, no drop, drop of anger will I feel. No grains of salt course through my veins. No matter what may be my game. I'll take my hand and play it well. Thus save me from a gamer's hell. Let me spin the fucking wheel. Down to slim pickings here too. Dog. Okay, Tyler is going to be player one. Okay. Oh! Tyler, that's a horrible gif you put in the chat. <laughs> I have bad news. What? What'd they get? Playing time killers, buddies. What? No! No, 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 no,
Killer. There are two moves named respectively Death Move and Super Death Move. Time Killer. Alright, let's get in there. Mantax. Mantax and Riffin. changing characters. Huh. So, who's who here? Uh, I think Tyler is Mantaz. Okay. And I believe Cool Dude is Rancid. Po Postmodern age 20. Oh, back to here. This is this year. This is the postmodern age. This is where we live. Alright, so. Rancid's game plan Rancid is, is actually. Kind of dude, is now. Cool Dude. <laughs> oh, <laughs> cool Dude is Cool Dude a time killer's gamer? The fucking. <laughs> what the fuck? Dude, the, the fact that the floor shakes every time you move is so funny. So I was gonna say, Rancid is definitely one of the strongest characters in this game. I know that for a fact. That's the only character I've been able to make work for me. Alright, but Tyler getting some footsies in there, looking actually pretty solid. Tyler back. returning the favor instantly. You die so fast in Time Killers. Yeah, I mean, they're, they're, they're not killing time in this yeah, game. Yeah, they, they're killing something. Um, all right, good. good. Training a little bit. I, I love the jump-ins. The air, the air game from Cool Dude is interesting. Who's sneaking under that move? I, 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 I always underutilize that. Oh, arm my God, the arm. arm gone. That is gonna- His arm is gone. That's gonna nerf Rancid's moveset, but he does still have the chainsaw arm. He has the chainsaw, arm, which is huge. Which is kind of the one he wants. Can Tyler capitalize, though? No, he no. no. Eats the knee. <laughs> the one arm kill, one arm victory, and cool dude takes, takes the round lead. One. I like that you got points for cutting off one limb. The one arm bandit. <laughs> All right, is Tyler gonna stick with Mantaz or are we moving to something yeah, else? Sticking with Mantaz. Mantaz. All right. So Mantaz is interesting because I think he has the highest like limb removal potential in the game because both of his arms have a sword yeah. on them. Mutant Armageddon 4000. Oh, too. I think this is the Mantaz. Sword. We're on Tyler's home turf now. The fucking headbutt. Oh, oh no, immediate! Oh no! no! <laughs> Somebody freaked out and pressed a lot of buttons. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> Tyler's game plan is interesting now. I was just talking a lot about how Mantis can stand have two arms to hit people. <laughs> he did lose them both in three fucking seconds. So <laughs> that was the arms falling on the keyboard. <laughs> Alright, but let's see if he can bring it back. You don't like this game anymore, why? <laughs> can this one be best of no. the No, hell no! Okay, okay, okay. I like having to play a lot more careful right now. Cool dude, though, not really having to have any caution Oh, the arm! Tyler... And the legs, and that's it! Tyler's gone, dude! Tyler had, had his limbs oh, torn right man. off. The poor man was drawn <laughs> in corners. Out hey, Queen, Queen, before we, before we blow this, can, can we show what the death move does? Oh, yeah, I'm gonna show something off, okay? Hold on a second. Hold on one second. Um, the death move is all five attack buttons. I'm gonna show you something that neither of our competitors did. No, do do Rancid. Rancid. I'm just doing Rancid. Yeah, Rancid. Rancid. I'm gonna show you something that uh, neither of our competitors did, but they could have done at any time. Okay. Yeah. This is important to know. No one attempted to bust out their super, which wasn't. I think someone so did. I think yeah. someone did, uh, and that's what broke it. So if you hit every attack button at once, you kill the other person in one hit, and there's nothing they can do about it. <laughs> so I'm kind of glad that nobody did that, but, and we got some real Time Killers gameplay, because that was entirely possible for anyone to do, maybe even by accident. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. There is a move called a death move. The super death move, which is only actable when you're close and they're stunned, cuts every limb off and then their head. Yeah. It's the same exact thing. It's the same thing, except it's more violent, I guess. This was the era of trying to be like Mortal Kombat and doing a really bad job of it. And Time god. Killers might be one of the worst examples of it that I've seen ever. Ready up the winner spinner. I'm going to run the bathroom. All right. Oh. All right, well, I'm afraid, Tyler, you are not going to be moving on, but you had a good run.
That was just our that that's a rough one to end up in the fucking trenches of. Oh yeah, we have to say the prayer. I swear before I spin this wheel. No, no drop, drop of anger, anger will, will I feel. feel. No, no grains, grains of salt, salt course through my veins. No, no matter, matter what may be my game. game. I'll take my hand and play it well. Thus save, save me from a gamer's, gamer's hell. hell. Game in. Game in. It's crazy that there's like six games left. Seven. All right. Number three. Ooh. This might be rough. Let's see it. I don't remember a lot of the ones that are left. I don't know any of them by now. I just don't remember. This is the worst possible poll. This is the worst game in Quibo. <laughs> oh, no. You got the worst game in Quibo. I'm sorry. Come join. It's Dino Rex. Some of clay figures discovered in the ruins of South America assume dinosaurs on which mankind ride. From this, some were of the option that mankind and dinosaurs live together. Did you know that shit? Cause I sure fucking did it. Dino Rex is better than that Dragon Ball game. I'm interested to see what cool dinosaurs we're going to be seeing today. Let's see if we have a Triceratops. Mothra's going yeah. with the Triceratops. Hard Knight going with the Allosaurus. Interesting oh, it's a beautiful, matchup. sunshiny day. This feels fake. Ow. Jesus Christ. It's a never-ending stream of noise, dude. I don't even know what to say about this. <laughs> I'm so sad that Mockroach hasn't gotten a single good video game. I mean, sometimes that's a- Whoa, my god! That's Wait, not a hand. Who's who? Is Mockroach the Triceratops? Mockroach is the Triceratops. Okay. Um, so I tried really hard looking into a tier list for this game. Oh my god! Believe it or not, there isn't one. <laughs> All right, so, so much help. I'm trying to figure out what to even say. Mothroach is just kind of jabbing at Hard Knight over damage. and over again. Knocking into the carpet. Oh Hard Knight is getting is attacked happening? by the strange fire beast at the corner of the map, I guess. I don't know <laughs> if that's actually doing damage. Um, okay, there's a standoff. There's some footsies happening. A little the bit of footsies happening. A little bit. Here. There's the big kick um, into the fireball! There's a big problem here. Mothroach does have a full power bar. I don't know what to fucking do Okay, with that, okay, dude. wait a second. So, Card Knight refills the power oh, bar, but gets just thrown right back into the horrible fighter zone. Just getting juggled around by the evil Triceratops wielded by Card Knight. Player one wins, round one. Oh, I'm sorry, wielded by Mothroach. I'm, I'm, I'm mixing my Is that up. a Mothroach dub, or is this a fucking two round game? If this is a two-round game, that's crazy. No, it is! It's a two-round game? Yup, 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 you have one golden egg in the bottom Ooh. left. Alright, on to round two. <laughs> this has a lot riding on it. <laughs> this is a high-stakes game! Alright. Here we go. So I I'm fucking okay, jumping so... T-Rex attacks. <laughs> Going for the aerial approach is interesting. I have no idea why it doesn't seem to connect. It feels like a lot of things just don't seem to I hit. I can't tell when shit's, like, hitting. Yeah, like, there are explosions all over Card Knight, and nothing has actually damaged the T-Rex, <laughs> the mighty Allosaurus. This feels like a mashing action figures against each other game. So, one thing I like a lot about Triceratops is his uh, picking sand up at you move that doesn't do any damage. No, it doesn't look at it. You have to hit the horns. Oh, he's got a sweet spot. Yeah, that's, really, sweet spot. that's kind of an unusual concept for a game of this uh, age. It does seem like Hard Knight's figuring Hard out Knight the back, Allosaurus. finding the spacing. Whoa, the big kick! But Mothroach bringing it back pretty mightily with Triceratops is killer neutral. Um, Triceratops, Triceratops does, does neutral. have some of the best neutral. Oh! I know that for a fact. Um, oh, close okay. one. Hard Knight bringing it back one and one. Who's going to take this first round? This is crazy. You're fucking losing it. I also think this is the longest game we've had this so far, going, which is We're going so to be funny. playing this for like 30 fucking minutes. Whoever if wins this game, you better win the next round, I swear to god. Alright. <laughs> I fucking- I like don't even know what to say. I literally don't know what to say. This is a game I'm watching, and it's like I'm not- I'm watching fucking, like, shapes move around. I don't- I- I'm- it's... I can't tell what's a move. Playing this seems awesome. This game feels like a fucking, like, King Kong stop motion fight. I- I'm watching a movie scene that's bad. It's like a bad one. 
sitcom background game. So I'm seeing Card Knight try to basically zone out Mothra yeah. with that big tail attack, but it feels like its uh, hitbox is extremely inconsistent and doesn't really hit the Triceratops all that often. Mothra just finding some points to catch Card the wake Knight up. in the corner. And card it with an empty power bar, Dude, which is not something you want. Mockroach not using the super at all. What are the- what's the guy down there doing? What's happening? Whoa! The dash it! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Jesus Christ, Triceratops, what was that all about? Huh? Did the- attack- oh, what? Alright. The fucking pterosaur just came down and ate her. Okay. Hit him? Well, that was round. That was one round. That was one round. That was dude. one single round of that game. Makro takes that first round. Are we gonna see any changes? The Triceratops is looking pretty players? good. The Allosaurus, you mean? No, the Triceratops. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. Mm. You can't just do that to the player that's messed up. I think that more fighting games should end with the uh, enemy manager being like... You have, like, a friend that gets killed for no reason? Oh, beautiful rainbow. Oh, this New is stage. so pretty. Decapitate someone? Alright, we have the Triceratops versus this thing. I don't even know who this is. The Cranium? This is the... What's the... They're in fucking... What's it called? Once Upon a Time. So I think the idea here is this has got to be one of the more mobile characters in the game. I don't think there's... I'm sure that this has the potential to pay off pretty well for Card Knight. It's gonna be close. <laughs> Dude, the fucking special move is so funny. Boom! Boom! What are you like? Oh my god! Triceratops! You knocked is another charged. dinosaur out! You knocked it like a projectile! What the fuck was there? There's that golden egg! Their golden egg is there! I think you want that! I don't know how you can I believe that. that's a thing you can eat to restore health or something. There are items in this game to some degree. Is anyone in control? What was that? There's no such thing. <laughs> okay, the pink, the pink <laughs> fucker showed up. The pink fucker showed up. Um, <laughs> Hard Knight in a bad situation here in the corner. The Triceratops oh just has this extremely oppressive offense. It feels hard to do anything this game about. This is insane. What is happening? I've got the Everything's like the same color. Um. I, I love the data bit little purple guy, dude. Alright, let's see how this one goes. I love the Trice. Whoa, you got a pin? It's all on the line here. Triceratops. That was a grab and it did like half Yeah, Mockroach doing a ton of damage with that. I have no idea how Mockroach is doing some of the stuff that. Mockroach is slowly figuring out moves. That's the benefit of sticking with a character, even though you might be like, oh, my maybe I lost that magic. Maybe that was harder than it should have been. You but still have the chance to know is, what you're doing. It looks like Card Knight's kind of getting the Cranium more. Yeah. Cranium seems to have some zoning tools, which uh -huh. is interesting and does play well to what I think Card Knight was trying the to three do. three kicks! But just getting four! One more! Oh, the whiff! Narrowly oh, avoiding that, Landing. jumping over the Triceratops, they're, they're but they're in each, each other. other. They're in each other, so no one's doing anything. Even oh. health bars and Card Knight taking the second round. I'm glad we get to see more of Dino Rex. Mockroach, I swear to fucking god, you have to win this. Let's go Card Knight! <laughs> I want to see this game as much as I can! I love the sounds of it! We do not want another round of this madness, are you fucking kidding me? Mm. Eleanor is Eleanor freaking out. Get the fuck out, dude. She hates this game. She can All right, probably. so... Yeah, it does feel a lot like the crane. I'm trying to understand what any of the characters do. He sneezes do. on you. And he's definitely, it looks like the zoner of this game. I thought he'd be more of an agile character, but it seems like his game plan is mostly just kicking that dust up, and he's a lot better at it than everyone else is. Oh my Mothra's god. Mothra's just kind of stunned by that. <laughs> I love something up on two legs. And knocking the cranium away, only to get knocked away again in return. Dude, the fucking... Oh, jumping over for a cross-up, but you're not allowed yeah, you're to- you're not allowed to cross-up. So I do want to say that, you're not allowed to cross-up in this game. If you go behind a different oh, a different no. player's character- Oh no! It will automatically make your dinosaur walk back to in front of them and take control away from got everybody. Getting ready to turn back again. I got good news, everybody! It's round three. We're it's going, going to game three! Game three. 
this is a disaster. Mmm, yeah! <laughs> Alright, are we gonna see the same characters? That this Steam? is a gamble. It's such a gamble. I mean, Mothra definitely feels like the Triceratops has been working for them. It went a little bit south. Oh, Hard Knight changing again! Them. I'm sort of surprised by that. Yeah, that was such like a dominant. The dino cranium shop. seemed like a strong character. Dude, and look at the baddies at the dino shop, though. Oh. oh. There, there's a cute girl at the dino shop. I've been thinking about asking her out. Dude, he's huge. I always see the girls who stand outside the dino shop. They don't move or breathe or do anything. But they do have a bunch of watermelons. <laughs> Uh, Snake, the rule is that you can only change characters if the game lets you. Yeah. Whoa! Wait, it's a big guy! There are not any strict, like, counterpick rules or anything like yeah. that. It's just that you're- Ah! Ah! <laughs> you were tickling too much, you pushed too much. Oh, okay. Going for the grab. Oh, there goes the pink guy. <laughs> so... The fucking pink guy is so funny! Mockroach seeming to really be Have using, an advantage here. I, kind I of feel using like... a similar strategy to what I feel uh, won Card Knight that last yeah. game. I, I I think that switching characters here might have been a mistake. As much as I understand wanting to see as much of the moveset for Dino Rex as possible and seeing everybody in the cast. I think Tyrannosaur just has fucking nothing, dude. Tyrannosaur seems to have a big problem in that he's definitely the slowest dinosaur in the game. And I don't think the speed's very high in this game in the first place. It looks cool though, sounds it like that. Cool. I don't think so. <laughs> so Tira definitely has high damage. Unfortunately, the range seems pretty miserable. Well, that's pretty good. Somehow outzoning that. Pretty good. Kicking dust in Triceratops' face, and that's an easy target to hit, given how small the Triceratops is compared to the Tyrannosaurus Rex. Wait, T-Rex actually kind of cooking here. All right, wait a Whoa, second. Oh my God! Are they bringing it back a lot, figuring some stuff out with wait, the big dude. purple dinosaur we all know and love, named the T-Rex, but getting juggled right into the big fucker. And this is just not a place you want to be versus the Triceratops and his domineering tail. Don't worry, here attack. comes here comes the head. The head's gonna push him just a second. That's gonna push him back and Our head now. Just feels stuck here. Fighting back almost this is no so close. damage, just being done. Too big. And Carnet clutching it out anyways. There's no way that this is going to game three the last Every last single game more time. time. Why are these the tightest games that have happened all fucking It's always some Evo. bullshit like this, dude. That was the creature. Alright. It's all on the line for this. This game is going to determine if somebody gets a prize. Mockroach can't Rebo. challenge that fucking Tyrannosaurus little footstep kick he's got. Spacing? Oh my god, oh. that's so much damage though. Like, Tyrannosaurus is such a good little jab. No way! So, um, Triceratops does have one really unique downside in this situation in that they completely lack Big any super. crouching moves. I didn't even realize the that. The Triceratops does not have a single crouching move. So although a lot of moves whiff on the Triceratops, like there are straight up a ton of moves that don't hit them, uh, they are really bad at like And they're being so able. long that if they're like lined up, it means that, uh, what's it called? Yeah, they, they cannot crouch and, you know, play that kind of more patient poking at you game as well as a lot of the other members of the Dino Rex cast can. You have to this wait is for down to the wire. Everyone's just flailing around in their respective corners. One mistake could end this game for everybody. I think I know what's going on, dude. I think I know what's going on. <gasps> nope. What was that? Attempted oh my god, down. It's Mock gonna be so fucking close. Away. No! Hard night with no! the one hit! You're one hit away! It was one hit! That was a one hit situation for both players down to the final golden egg! The big purple fuck takes it! Oh, man. Look at this fucking freeze frame, dude. And that is the last you'll ever have to see of Dino Rex in your life. Oh my god. And. Last. Before we get to our uh, our, our exciting whatevers, uh huh, 
we get Aubrey and Tia. Aubrey will be player two. Battle. Yeah, Tia is going to be player one. Aubrey is going to be player two. I'm excited for the Sheepy Battle, dude. And luckily, I believe that is probably the worst game remaining on the list. There's, I think, one good. other bad one. That was by far the worst one. Though. Yeah. So, with that, let's speed this along and say the gamer's prayer. I swear, I swear before, before I spin this wheel, wheel no, no drop of anger will I feel. No grains of salt grow through my veins, no matter <laughs> what may be my game. game. I'll, I'll take my hand and play it well, well thus save me from, from a gamer's, gamer's hell. hell. Amen. Amen. I think it is, this is really good for our remaining competitors, because I think Tia and Card Knight both, like, play video games, play fighting games a lot, which really sets them up well for what Whoa. we have left, I think. That was scary. That was four? Yeah. Um, oh, dude. This is huge. This is huge. This game is awesome. This is a I cool love this one. game. All right. Uh, 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 uh. You hope there aren't any pink egg stealing creatures in this one? You actually, you never know, dude. All right. Feel Run free. It. Oh, what's that? That familiar green tint. That familiar green Geo? tint oh, of the Neo Geo. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Everyone feel free to parsec in. Let's get this shit on I'll the road, baby. Quick. You ready? You ready for Galaxy Fight? I think Rumi is basically like a Felicia like, right? Um, I don't know specifically. I think I she's think got she's like a, a little thing. bit similar. All right, round one. There's there's cute charge characters and there's mean charge characters, and she's definitely like a cute charge character. I might be wrong about that, but she feels like it. All right, let's see how this goes. Let's run it. All right, I was trying to get in there, but getting kept out of me. So big thing about this game, there's no corner. There is no it, corner. You can go useful. for as fucking long as you like, which is kind of a fun little. I agree like with that. a nice little short string there. Yeah, I agree with a little string Good there. Start. Decent spacing too, I think. This is the strat, dude. Trying to block an overhead on Parsec, but Aubrey manages to do it pretty well. Movement in this looks really fast-paced compared to last game. Watching Dino Rex <laughs> makes everything look fast. You see it? Oh Magic my god! Jabs. Just a bunch of gems! There's the ball! The roomy ball! The famous roomy ball! I, 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 that's the thing I see in here. I, as Tia is busting out some moves. I don't know yeah. if I've seen Jury do any moves. No, I have not seen Aubrey do any moves. Timeout? Timeout? Whoa! Rumi wins with the timeout, though! That's so sad! I didn't even notice! That's a fast fucking timer! That's a fast timer, dude. That's a fast timer. I think that's gonna change the pace of this game a no, little bit. No, entirely. You can just wait it out. <laughs> oh no, but Aubrey being kept out pretty hard. And Aubrey's to gotta be idea. patient, that's the problem! The, the short timer, but you have to be patient still, yeah. Boom. Oh my god. Boom! I think this is it. One move, one move! There's the lows, and that's and gonna do it! Goes. Round one goes to Tio. Got that Tekken timer? That looked so looked competitive fast. in that first round, but the timer just Dude, I, I, took you. The timer felt like it threw off the rhythm completely. These are double These are like 30 seconds second rounds. rounds. I guess this is compensating for. Uh, yeah, this is catching us up. They were like, yo, that, that, that last game went pretty long. We gotta get, we gotta get speed this thing up over here. All right, well, Tia taking round one. Aubrey sticking with, uh, what's your Yuri. face, though? Let me, let me look at fucking Yuri's moves. Strength is beauty. Do you think you can defeat me? Oh, well, it's a pretty cute little beast girl. All right. Aubrey with the blocks. Yeah, Aubrey was doing really well with the neutral. She's got like ground, ready. but I, you, you could feel the patience disappear as yeah. soon as, as, the, as soon as, as, soon as that timer timer became a known quantity. It was like you can't play super neutral footsies in this game as much as you can in some others. But you still have to be kind of aggressive. Yeah. This, this is a, a, a puzzle for crap, kind of. I'm surprised Aubrey's not doing any moves, because this is a quarter circle ass character. I feel like it's easy to just say, you know, I'm just going to try and do the yeah, neutral and whatnot, space but... normals. And it does feel like Jury has these decent normals, but now all Tia has to do is put the yeah, away. You just have to do your big super rabbit jump. You have to go bunny jump and go, I'm out of here. And I think Ruby has out. really good mobility, so yeah. it's pretty easy if it gets to like a there are ten seconds left on the clock. 
comes the ball. Here comes the ball. All right, let's see. Oh, dashing in, dude. I've been and there. I, I'm, I'm seeing it, man. It's, it, this feels like it's the same kind of story as that first round. That, that first we just round. Saw. This is sort of the predecessor to Waku Waku. I don't remember what this company is called. Every fucking game they made is awesome. They have a third a one that's flying just getting hard countered constantly. by Rudy, who seems to have all this, we'll like, we'll air capability. Yeah. Sunsoft? Yeah. Is there one game I really wanted to be at Quiva, but it does not work with the... Uh... Oh! Oh. With the big cartoon punch! I think that's it. Tia takes it with the big cartoon punch. Tia does take Ooh. it with the big cartoon Hit him with the... Why I got a... Boom! That was five seconds of video game. Unsurprisingly, I would say to some degree, Tia going deep in the tournament. Tia sweep inbound. I wouldn't say that just yet. Tia yeah, has just also yet. been getting games that knows how to play. Really good draw. <laughs> really lucky. There, there's, you, you, uh, that seems like it's just hard to do anything about. Yeah, no, I, I feel like that's a difficult one for, for you, Aubrey. I'm sorry, but... And with that... You're still in it! Loser's bracket, dude. All right. Our, our wonderful guests fighting it out in round five and six. Mock Roach, Theo. Is this still top, technically just top eight? Uh, yeah, this is top eight. All right, Uh, so we got Mock Roach and Theo. Who's going to be player one and who's going to be player two here? Um, I will do a coin flip, and whoever wins it has preference. All right. Unless someone voices a particular preference. We're doing coin flip rules here. Uh, but we're also going to do something a little bit different, and we're going to say the gamer's prayer. I swear before, before I, I spin, spin this wheel, wheel no, no drop of anger will I feel, no, no grains of salt course through my veins, veins no matter, matter what may be my game, game I'll, I'll take my hand and play it well, thus save, save me from, from the gamer's game. hell. All right, Tails is Theo. All right, so Ed. Theo. So it is going to be Mock Roach's pick. Ah. I don't know if I remember what this one is. So wait, what's going what, what, on? Which one is it? Mock Roach is staying player one. Okay. All right, so Mock Roach player one and Theo player two. What what number did we get? Uh, I got eight. Eight? Yeah. I think I know what this one is. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is on the Neo Geo 2. We're on a fucking Neo Geo streak, dog. There's a lot of fucking fighting games on that thing, dude. All right, uh, feel free to parsec in. You're playing King of the Monsters. We're doing King of the Monsters, and King of the Monsters will determine the fate of somebody at Quivo. That's crazy. This is for the prize, dude. This is for the consolation prize. Mockroach and Theo, that's crazy. Alright, so this is a wrestling style game. I think that you can end it early by going for pin. So that's over a grounded opponent. Hit your heavy punch button. Alright, this is uh for the fucking bananas, dude. This is the first one that's truly for a banana. Mockroach player one, Theo player two, Mockroach going with the eight, and Theo going with the beetle. The beetle? All right, let's see how this plays out. I'm very excited. I like the Beetle a lot. So All right, starting by running into each other and hitting a bunch of buttons on my keyboard that aren't a part of the game. I don't think that electricity is like a thing to get like hurt by. By the way, I'm pretty sure that it's just that a is... border. <laughs> all right, all right. <sighs> Grapples for Mockroach here. So as you can see, though, there are a bunch of items and stuff scattered throughout the world, I think. It went up I, for I a minute, believe, wait, it's a giant beetle. I do, the pin, nothing. I do believe it's not just, like, punch each other and eventually win. There are little pickups that you can get with some yeah. of the buildings. If you've ever played the GameCube ones, like Godzilla Destroy All Monsters, it's This is thing, kind of thing. like that. This is like a predecessor to that sort of video game. But Mako is staying strong the, the grapple P. game. Getting the P! I think you can mash to get up faster. And now Theo and Mockroach are both under attack by the United States military. Into Tokyo Tower, there's the big kick. Oh my Somehow god. Somehow takes it. Oh, the big P! Gets the big P, I think. Theo! 
Oh, Theo charging yeah. something up. Theo charging something yeah, I think nasty he got punched up, out of it. But not getting to get it off. Mockroach interrupting him before anything happens, then tossing him away into the rubble. Mockroach charging, but getting interrupted by the military. That's kind of huge. Oh, wait. <laughs> Bouncing off the walls? Oh, Whoa! the huge pile driver from Theo. Off the wall, going for the big peak. Gets stuck on the building. Big pile driver. Oh, my God. <laughs> And the, the, they're doing so much damage when you when you got those peas. It just feels like stuff just does play. Boom. And Theo has a lot of peas Dude, right Theo now. taking the momentum away. But we saw how quickly the momentum changed to get Theo here in the first yeah. place. It could change again so easily. The health bar drains pretty slowly Suplex in this game. Gets a little bit. A pea comes out. But I it don't think the like, empty uh, health bar means that pin. you lose unless you get pinned. But Makro traverses it. Has one little chance here still. Three hits. Hitting Theo on the ground. Mockroach might want to try and go for an early pin if they can get Theo on the ground again. Oh man, this is getting close, dude. And you can see the weaponry. Bombs! Bombs! Roll down Theo's brain can't get the pin! Oh, but getting Mockroach up again instead! Theo needs to go for that pin if he wants to win! Because Mockroach keeps hitting these reversals, throwing Theo into the electric fence! There's one of his own. Does nobody know how to pin? I think I think it might be the other button. Did you do it wrong? I don't think so. <laughs> if this is a play of the timeout, that's fine by me. Because we're about to strike that bottom point. Oh my god, the last ditch effort! Wait! What happens? Micro's trying to figure something out. Both at zero health! Nothing! I literally don't know. <laughs> We're getting bad. <laughs> ba and bad. Who I think those? I think I count that as a draw. Look at points? the points. If we do points, then I guess Theo won. Theo did technically have higher damage, and I think placed and oh my god, oh my god, that's dark. You got a pinfall. In my mind, I would count that as a draw. Rematch? Rematch? Redo? Okay. I think that's probably, uh... I think that's probably the move. <clears throat> yeah, people were going for the pins, and it was yeah. just doing the wrong thing. Alright. Boot, say your apologies. I told them! I literally told them in chat! Say your apologies. I assumed that you would at least try a different button. I assumed when you go for five pins that you'd be trying a different button. So yeah, let's, let's criticize the people playing the game. Look, it's hard to find out what buttons on this correlate to what. Whatever, we're doing it again. Run it back. Starting a King of the Monsters exactly match exactly as it. it has to start by running into each other and falling down onto the ground. Big tradesies here. Bakroch coming out on top with the big stomp. Going for a pin immediately! Okay, okay, so that changes working, yeah. the dynamic completely. <laughs> that, that totally changes the game. Okay, completely. Okay, okay. We'll run it back. Going for it again? No way. You gotta have more more damage on that. I think the early pin's the worst strategy in the world, but I feel like I have an audience of mashers. I only yeah. know mashers. I don't wanna know people who can't mash a button to get up. Mockroach staying steadily ahead here, but getting knocked down Yeah, by I think this, this is going to flip anyway. The momentum can shift so easily. The big so jump easily. is crazy. It's just that Mockroach has two Ps, and Theo hasn't oh gotten a single P yet. Big kick, big kick. No throw. The fucking trains he's here. Dude, crazy. they're going crazy. Going. <laughs> Theo going for their early pin. Mockroach yeah, you breaking out I of feel it. like you got to have the health, like, gone, dude. But the power, the pile driver... The pile driver is so big. Oh, Theo doesn't know that the stun is up. And those pile drivers... Oh! Whoa! Dodging and making Theo run right into the electric... That doesn't get that much this off of it. This is the pin, but... not there fast enough. And a grapple. There's a grab. Are you going to get the P? It feels like these grabs tend to spawn the Ps, which yeah, is something Yeah, definitely throwing want. is getting a P. And the health, the the health bars are just draining so quickly at this point. Yeah, this is a good one. Here as soon as you pin. get a couple of Ps... All right, Theo breaking out, but it's definitely taking a little bit longer to get out of it yeah. at this point, at this stage of health. And Theo has more health than Mockroach, so... It's gonna be a close one, man. Theo's the bug, right? 
Yes. He was bugging. It's knocked down. Right. Go for the pinner, go for the getting another the P. P. That's the much needed damage that could completely change. I think that the P is again. doing your special, not the up. I feel like it increases the damage. <laughs> I love running directly to the electric wall. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm talking out of my ass. I'm making up my own negate. Oh, game here it comes. Head, but... Oh, got up because of the fucking helicopters. Okay, here's the zero health. This might be it. Two, the two count. mashing out. The P also might be like a pin meter or something. Yeah. I probably should have looked into the game mechanics. But I kind of was like, this one's self-explanatory. Oh my Dude, god. This two count is crazy. With 40 seconds to go. All right, you want that P, I think, definitely. Because if that does empower the pin... <laughs> here it comes! There's it's the crown! It's so hard for anyone to get anything done here, man! It's the classic wrestling game special, dude! You gotta go for it! That's it! That's it! That's a Theo dub, dude! That's Theo taking round one. The first real round! The first the real round, absolutely. Ending with a pin. Oh, okay, that just revives you. We're not gonna do that. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that would just be like normal. You can zap by fucking lightning instead. All right, man. That's crazy. Right. This game is fucking tight. Let's move on to round two. Let's see if there are any changes in who anyone wants to play. Yeah, big, totally man. different. At least you got this, Sean. The superhero versus the Godzilla. Who's gonna win? I love that these like big monster games all are like a million years long. It would just suck to live here. That's the big thing. That's <laughs> yeah, the I mean that's the thing. given. Okay, so Theo's the big lizard now. Yes, Theo is a Godzilla. The reversal. That was an attempt at a reversal. Yeah. Uh, well, what the hell? I don't know what that was. <laughs> we're chilling. We're chilling. They're not on the same plane, so they're just slipping. Right. Hey! <laughs> Into the planes, dude! No really pin. The helicopter's are out, so it's probably not worth it. Nobody with an especially dominating, uh. No, not at all. Run here, and I, I, I do think that the P's seem to increase your ability to pin, so. They really want to be going for as many grabs as possible. Yeah, I think to that get makes those. sense. There's the reversal! A double! Oh. A double reversal! No P out of that, though, which is so tragic. Oh my god. Oh, the oh! Peel actually getting the reversal that time and sticking with it. Slingshotting. Mockroach into the electric fence. The Mockroach getting a HP P, nonetheless. It's like not even worth going for a pin until the. Oh, wait! I mean, if someone's really not prepared for it, maybe you can get uh, yeah. an early pin, but it feels really hard when you have any health at all and you have, like, less than four or five P meters. It seems like right now they're Speaking just of, Mockroach is stocking up on those fucking He's gotta things. get those grabs in there. Yeah, just Dude. the one count. Yeah, no, Theo, Theo fighting for his life out here, but... He's gotta get some smaller throws. That's what he needs. The health bars are pretty low here, but... It does feel like everyone's kind of understanding the ebb and flow of the game a bit yeah. better as it goes on. This is yeah, one of those... The damage. This is one of those games that, like, actually feels like having game knowledge is helpful in a way that isn't always the case for something so straight-up arcadey. Which, like that's the, the classic fighting gameism, dude. The grab reversals alone feel like they change the way that it works a yeah. lot. Are you going for it? Going for a pin? Going for a pin, and somehow avoiding all of the big fiery orbs. Theo's in it. Theo's in it, dude. That's the thing with this little health. It could be fucking anyone. Like, yeah, there's the orb bias on Mockroach, but we don't know how much that actually comes into play. Like, truly. We're about to find out. All right, is this another pin? No. no. Mockroach breaking out. But time's running really, really time's low here. Out. 
Someone's gotta get something. You have to go for it. Makes Mock it out. Coach breaking out, but Mock Rush needs to get a pin You have too. to do it now, you have to do it now! Oh, going for the P, going for the P! Getting the pin, eight seconds on the clock, is it enough? No! Oh my god. Theo, wasting Theo timing out! I'm going for the fucking P! What do we do about do this? Do, this, feels, this feels like it's such a hard game to win. What do we do? Pet? Alright. <laughs> you just settle it on points? No, it's so, I'm gonna Roach. do a tiebreaker. I'm gonna say Mockroach takes this on points. We did say... We did not say this on points because Theo won the first one. No, but we said... Okay, okay, no, I see, I see. Last one. Yeah, I think that we just do this on points for that yeah. one and have one points is tiebreaker. Game. Points is tiebreaker. Because otherwise, we will be here literally all fucking day playing King of the Monsters. I think. I think hitting continue for both people next time that it ends up like that is yeah. also a bad idea, and just going until somebody gets the fucking pin. I feel like that's the move for final round. It's all gonna come together here. <laughs> I where the fuck are you? <laughs> Mockroach running off stage and just kinda going somewhere. I appreciate Theo popping the beetle again. <laughs> this is anyone's game. Yeah, point tiebreaker. Here's the thing, there are like charge moves in this game. Yeah, no, no one's, one's used, used any. People are not doing things that are on the control list, I think. Right? I think so. Like, I think the character Mockroach is playing has a projectile that he can charge up. I saw someone try to go for a charge at some yeah. point, but they were knocked out of it at a... This superhero might be one of the worst his job. I don't know if he's a superhero. He could just be like, uh, whatchamacallit. Dude, feel having a fuck- Oh my god! Yeah, see? Going for the fucking Oh my charge. god! That did so much. Oh my god. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh Jesus my god! The dynamic completely shifting! Oh my god! And getting the two count with a minute 40 in the round still. Yeah, oh, you've got the horn cannon. But Theo responding with a charge group of his own. The game has changed, ladies and gentlemen, and everybody else. <laughs> We're going for a crazy zoning battle now. Oh my god, there's the pin, dude, and look at the life difference! Theo's got a match for his fucking life! Mockroach fighting for the chance to play a real fighting game. Oh my god. Narrowly avoiding it! Both people coming oh! for his trainsies! Theo gets up first somehow. Theo gets up first, but isn't lined I'll up. The charge oh, waiting for it. Going all the way! Such an easy opportunity to interrupt Theo here. Oh, jumps away! Creating Dude, a little bit gonna, of distance, maybe gonna, gonna go really for intense. another awesome Ultraman beam. Oh my god, and Theo getting shot to right into... Theo just in a bad map position here! He's on the ground! Nope. Oh. Mockroach wisely just kind of throwing that one out, because that was a bad <laughs> position. And going for the pile driver, yeah, that's gonna make a pee! This could be it. Two hits! Tagging on a little bit Two of hits extra damage! The that's it! <laughs> oh my god. That was like a real one. That was the realest one yet. That game got a lot better when people figured it out a little bit. Oh my god. The second you find out you can do a beam that does a third of the other person's health. Oh my god. Theo, lovingly out of the tournament. Theo. Thank you for the competition. I think that was a sleigh run. That was a sleigh run. I'm sorry you had to play four rounds of that. I'm sorry that... <laughs> little salute emoji. I think everyone in Guivo is my goat. Everyone? Not like, just the literal goat. I'm shocked at how many good matches there have been. Like, the, 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 the change... I love the changing dynamic. That game is straight ass. <laughs>
I love it. It got killed at the end. And, and the, that, that last round was good, though. That, that last was round was good. actually good. The, the, the dynamic changing as a game goes on and people slowly learn that there are options in the video game is, is so funny to me. I love watching it. Okay. Cool dude, Aubrey. Let me quickly move this crap around though this is for top four this is wild mockroach moving on though mockroach moving on mockroach getting a prize the more you played it the less you were able to do the throws <laughs> no it's because your ass had to be mashing dude you got those hands tired all right cool dude and aubrey is our next round and before we get to that let's say the gamer's prayer I swear, I swear before I spin this wheel, no drop of anger will I feel, no grains of salt course through my veins, no matter what may be my game, I'll take my hand and play it well, this will save me from a gamer's hell. Game end. It's crazy that Cool Dude also has had all these rematches. Yeah. There's been, it's like, a Cool Dude takes on Naoket two times. Okay. Cool Dude taking on Aubrey again, too. Coin flip back. coming. Uh, we're playing Voltage Fighter fucking, oh. what was it? Gal Kaiser. Voltage Fighter Gal Kaiser is our next game. Let's see Great what's gonna games. happen here. First round. Let's get into this shit, baby. This guy's kind of fucking sick, dude. That one's kind of cool. Yeah, alright. So, Aubrey and Dead Long. Versus Barry. Cool dude. So, Shen Long is kind of the, uh. I'm the fucking uh, Shoto of this game. Is he? Yeah, kinda. Look how much fucking health he lost for that. This is a game that That's moves pretty fast. Game. Yeah, he's yeah, got, this he's is got a BP. Fucking dude. Ah! Oh my god, alright, but the grab takes Aubrey down to pretty low health. Aubrey feeling some moves out this time, at least, but... Yeah, this looks like something's coming, dude. Oh, oh that, left, that left Shenlong so yeah, vulnerable. I'm, I'm the block, I'm the that block. was the most minus move ever made, perhaps. Right, I bring it to round two. Let's see what happens. The fucking blades. The dude. giant wheel fucking Shenlong right dude, DP, over. Though, the DP is really important to have. Actual nice DP. Is that fucking overhead? The range is like so just barely short. And Aubrey, and huge. Aubrey showing that genuine neutral ability that we yeah. saw, but with a way more generous timer. It's not an overhead. It's not an overhead. Still not. Oh! Oh no. Oh, with the grab, huge. Literally even. Aubrey, Aubrey runs the oh. oh. But runs right into that because of that little cartwheel move. <laughs> Commits to the cartwheel and drops it. Cool looking dude. close though, looking close though. Cool, cool dude, dude taking with the round one. one, but also genuinely close. Your blood pressure <laughs> is getting higher. You have a heart rate of 368. What the fuck does this mean? It's, it's showing you a secret. It's showing you a move. Oh. Oh wait, wait, you can't. One's worst, and it, what is happening? All right. So if you choose continue, you get to learn a new move. That's kind of awesome. Opponent. That's kind of a cool mechanic. All right, run it back. Run it back. Baby. Pizza. Ken Log and Marion. Pizza, cops, tiny cat, little dolphin, billboard. All right. It feels like you have to be so fucking careful about approaching her. Oh my god, dude. Aubrey had a pretty big health deficit already, unfortunately. But I don't think it's over, not even close. Playing a bit cautious, but so many of Shenlong's moves seem to just leave him wide open. Those fireballs seem good. Oh, no, but eating! Alright, torrent life for Aubrey. Eating a scary it's so weird robot after like 15 straight minutes of King of the Monsters, remembering that fighting games go really quickly. Oh, huge though! Great oh, aerial! Here. Cool dude Aubrey just playing pretty pressure. smart here too though. I'm expecting the ball. No ball. Man just hit with that. That's kind of big. There's the ball. Little punch. Yeah. It's the fucking cartwheel. That dude. cartwheel's a bad move. That's it's just it's a, not a bad move. It's just so situational. It's so high commitment. And that ball. Cool dude busting out that ball at just the right time every single time. Everything. Oh my god, dashing in there. Really scary situation. It's uh, like a one hit game dashing in, blocking things out. Oh, the car wheel hits the car wheel, but that's the. Aubrey drops it for a very, very close final round. That was just to the wire every single time.
And cool dude, your blood pressure is getting higher. All right. Good game. That, that took, game. That is that took five fucking seconds. Probably the most exciting match of the tournament by far right now. That was like crazy. That was so my awesome. pockets, that bro. So close, Aubrey. Oh well, Aubrey, you had a good run. I I, I think run. that you you had so many like single hit games at the end. It's yeah. really funny how consistent that was with every single match you were in. Good game. Good game. Good game. Aubrey and great game to cool dude. Fuck Who's it. going in? Having a really really solid losers run right now with like. Tons of rematches. The, the cool dude Aubrey rematch. Aubrey, mm -hmm. the queen of soul caliber. But queen of soul caliber. But the ringers are gone, dude. Actually, true. That was the last. Uh, what's it called? The last uh, baby invite. Yeah, last baby invite officially knocked out. It is down to exclusively people who. Hard night, cool dude, Mockroach and Tia making the top four, each going home with a little something that you'll see in three matches. Four. Oh, dude. No, this is winners finals. Yeah. All right, so Tia is going to be player one, and Carnate's going to be player two. That is not something that they can trade. And this is best to. Uh, it's still first to three, first to two. Best of three, yeah. Best of three, yeah, yeah, yeah. You've lost one hundred thousand channel points this stream. I'm sure that there's like someone in here who's going home with like a million, dude. <laughs> like actually, someone's gonna make money. Someone's making bank out here. All right, well, let's just keep moving things along, man. I swear, where I, before where I, spin I spin this, this wheel, wheel, no drop of anger will I feel, no grains of salt course through my veins, no matter what may be my game, I'll, I'll take my hand and play it well, this save me from, from a gamer's hell. Alright. Alright. What's the game? We only have three games left. Isn't that crazy? That's such a good draw. Whoa. That's such a good draw, dude. Dude, I've been really excited to see this game. I've been excited to see this video game. This is Tia and Card Knight, right? And this is Tia and Card Knight. I am excited. What are these noises, dude? Oh, I gave every single thing on the wheel a sound a that uh, vaguely relates to the video game. In my mind, because I, I think Wheel of Names has a bunch of sound clips you can choose that are built in. Wait, what letter does this one start with? You can just show me the game. Oh! Yep. Oh! It's Doraku Tenshi, the Fallen Angels. Doraku Tenshi, the Fallen Angels. A technically incomplete fighting game. I'm just thinking, what are the fucking odds that no, like, fake game made it to top four? All right. All right, let's get our button checked. Here comes new challenger. All right, let's do button checks. Make sure everything's feeling okay. Cool. Cool. Harry Ness. <laughs> Harry Ness. The Harry Ness. Harry Ness. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta, dude. This game looks fucking crazy, by the way. This game's sprite art is fucking insane to me. The animations, dude. <laughs> When was this from? I don't remember. I think that the this game was primarily done by the guy who ended up like doing a lot of design for King of Fighters later down the line. Like this is, like, is this is like a game that is not complete technically, but they're mashing. We're good. Mashing. All right. Crafted like forty percent. It's gonna be real fun. There are a few characters in this who directly like had designs more or less be reused for KOF later on. That doesn't surprise me. Oh, dude, oh, Haiji. Harry versus Haiji. Haiji's pretty nice in this game. These are two of the characters in this game who are way closer to being like a real character. Oh my god, dude. Whoa, dude, the bomb is so big. The zoning is so hard to do anything about. But you can crouch it. That's like a part that hadn't been noticed yet. 
the cart and just keeps heading up in a situation and jumping into it. Oh my god. The gun. Now the corner. Alright, pre pre pretty dominant round. Pretty dominant match. Jesus Christ, right, what a win pose, dude. But Harry does have that little ammo counter yeah. on the side of the screen. So playing cautious, and I think you have a pretty big timer in this game. Can be a There's a two-minute fucking timer. Against that guy. Yeah, you have a two-fucking-minute timer. You have a lot of time to be patient. After, after a lot of games where you have to uh, wait in, like, 30 seconts. Carnite put up a build a fight this oh, round. You have to be ready for that missile, it's coming. Go knock down. Oh, win. Oh! Skip on that little combo ender. Leaving Carnite and Mega through. vulnerable. Yeah, I was gonna stay here and pump I knew the missile! Oh man, dude! That's awesome! The missile call out, that's crazy! Strong. Not strong enough. Can you take it round one? Tia taking round one, dude. Let's move on to round two here. This is this is crazy. That was such like a just good fucking call out missile, dude. Oh, Carnet nice. switching to Roche. This character's fucking sick, man. What the hell? Roche is pretty fucking cracked in this game, actually. Oh my god. Oh. Alright, crazy command grab doing way, way, way more damage than that last guy did. Roche feels like a way down. better pick just yeah. because he's not ball. getting locked down by his really slow speed, which that uh, previous guy definitely had. I, I forget his fucking name, but... One more hit will do it. The grab oh, down to the fucking No missile beams get the missile! Gotta play cautious. Oh the cross-up! Oh man! Huge cross-up! <laughs> the parsec cross-up! Oh shit, guys is sick! Alright, hard night taking that one, but I have to look at the map. <laughs> <laughs> Not that high damage though. Yeah. Overall, it definitely works for. It's just good carry. to get that space. Yeah, it, it builds that space. Does it cost a missile? It does cost a missile. Harry's command grab costs a missile because he's blowing you up with the missile at point blank range. All popping DPs get nothing for it. It's so good to have normals that go under the missile. Oh no. Okay, still hitting the target. The DP. Not quite. We'll see where it goes. Dude, this could be it! This could be huge. Just the missile- Okay, the missile is refill every round. Torment life for Card Knight, not Torment life. Card not Card Knight, but- Winner's life, life for, for Card Knight. This could be sending Tia to Grams, depending on how it goes. Dude, Tia's going crazy right now. Tries to wait for it. Nice patience there. Roche was just looking so good. And so and it's still looking fine, but it's just it's like guarding it. Good, but it- 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 he is really playing around with his grabs and really nailing these DPs, which is Harry, kind of huge. Harry is, I think, a great grab. When I was experiencing this, Harry's probably one of the most versatile guys in the game, and it's what really- What the hell? Did Tia just get a fucking super out? Oh my god! <laughs> Jesus Christ! What the fuck, dude? <laughs> Ready for some teammate behind bars? Ready for some time behind bars? Oh my god, well, Tia. You were just that. you just started mashing double curl, circle, and circle forwards. That's so smart. Every single special in this game is double quarters. Yeah, circle that's forwards. like that's the traditional super input. Literally every single one of them. Dude, that game kind of sick. <laughs> He's arresting that emo boy. Maybe you put the AC back on. Thank you. Let me turn it down a little bit, though. This game's awesome. I actually love this game. This is, I think, my favorite game in the well, lineup for finals. Weebo. Okay, so with that, we go to top four. Top four losers. Losers finals. And then we're fucking in it, baby. All right, man. So, Card Knight. Still in it. Card Knight's still in it. Still Card Knight staying alive in, in uh, losers finals. But going down here for now. All right, it's Mockroach cool and Cool Dudes, though. I think, right? 
Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm getting confused because I've, I've been streaming. Flipping for the four coin. Hours. Flipping the coin. Heads. So that means that uh, Mockroach pick. All right, Mockroach, what you feeling? And while you're telling us what you're feeling, let's say the Mockroach is, is P1. <clears throat> I swear, swear before, before I, I spin, spin this wheel, no, no drop, drop of anger will I feel, no, no grains of salt course through my veins, no matter what may be my game, I'll take my hand and play it well, but save me from a gamer's hell. Amen. Amen, dog. Amen. Mockroach is what? Mockroach is player one. Okay. <laughs> Mad respect to Mockroach for, uh... Fighting all this way to get to one real game. What round is this? Uh, this is just uh, losers. Losers top four. Because we are playing cyberbots. We're bots. playing cyberbots. We are playing cyberbots instead. <laughs> Yo! Mockroach and cool dude, get the fuck in here. I'm so excited. I'm so excited, dude. We're really, like, rushing up to the fucking end of the tournament. All right. Let's do this fucking shit. Mockroach versus Cool Dude in Cyberbots. Who is going to end up in Losers Finals and who is going to be going on after a really fucking solid run, by the way? Yeah. I. Th this is like. This is. I think Losers Finals and the build up to it, like the top four, is my favorite like part of any tournament. This is, I think, one of the most fun parts. The stakes are so fucking yeah. high. Just in, you are interested in like moving along and. We're getting right into it, though. All right, so we got Mockroach's Lightning and Cool Dude is Jackal. Dude, Lightning is fucking crazy. Yeah, Lightning has got some fucking crazy zoning shit in this game, and I, 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 I think in general Whoa. just kind of is crazy yeah. in, in, in a few ways. I, I think getting they're up by the weapon, though. Yeah, Lightning has a really solid weapon, if I remember right. And that whip is crazy, but Jackal. Jackal is the whip one. Oh, really? Oh, yeah, I'm, I was confused. I got confused, because I was, like, stupid, I guess. Lightning has a really good missile, is what I yes. meant to say. Which makes sense, because it is a giant missile on your shoulder. <laughs> um, Jackal has the crazy whip, and really, like, fucking badass normals. That grab is so fun. Yeah, I'm, I'm just watching this intently. This is like, <laughs> dude, there's so much shit happening in this game, dude. All right. Oh! Ah, oh, cool dude. Cool dude taken over, Tark destroyed. The projectile, I, I, that, I, that was such a, like, mobile one, dude. Youth is precious, Charizard. Sure. That's a, you know, good advice, old man. Oh. <laughs> okay, I don't care about okay, that, cool, though. No. Alright, that's round one for, uh, that's round, round one for cool dude. This is it. Torrent life for mock dude. What's crazy is we don't have to spin the wheel for the next one. That's true. I don't think we can, even. Here we go! <laughs> Alright, rematch. Back to Lightning and Jackal again. This could be it for Mockroach. It all comes down to this. If Cool Dude takes this, Cool Dude moves on to Loser's Finals, and Mockroach, after Grabs are huge. having to play a lot of fucking shit. Just getting knocked dude. out, dude. It's just so hard to get in on Jackal. The keep away game is so crazy here. Getting the missiles in, but you're not going to make it high enough. And the jump is just not enough. Last stock. All right. Dude, I'm like... Tiny hits on lightning. There's the I'm entrance. I'm so on edge. I'm Knocked so back on out. edge. Keeping it in, though. Mockroach staying in, which is probably what you want to do. Jackal's big zoning grab on Jackal? is just so big. Huge grab, keeping cool, dude. Firmly planted in the corner with that fucking lightning bullshit too. That chainsaw being pretty useful goes for the fucking anti air, which is not what you want to do in that situation. But staying, <laughs> really big grab, strong, almost impressive combat. You, see here. you have it, you have it. Oh my god! No, no, no. no. robot disabled, ran out of power. No. It was just TG oh. one hit away. Dude, the fucking one hit! Well, the bright side is, Mockroach, with a wonderful run, you got to play one real game. And I gotta say, you're going home with a little something. You'll see.
You are. Hey, that's the that's the bright side at this point. If you're getting knocked out now, you're getting something still. You are still getting a fun mystery prize, regardless of regardless of everything. That was a great run for Mockroach. Everybody, please give Mockroach a hand. Mockroach had to endure a lot more trauma than everybody else who's in the bracket at this point. Oh man. Oh my god. And with that. We said the prize. We will say the prize is at the end. Yeah. We are gonna get to it. We are gonna get to it. We're very close to it. I just want to keep everything mysterious. Yeah, because like, what else the fuck do we have? You know, we don't have some tension. Our losers finals. Oh my god. Hard night, cool dude. Hard night and cool dude. And I know exactly what you're both playing already because there's only one thing left on our spinner. All right, our last game. Here it comes. Our losers finals game is X Men. X Men Mutant, Mutant Academy, Academy Two. two. For the PlayStation 1. Are we going right to Pool Party? Oh, you gotta see fucking Pool Party Magneto. I dude. wanna know what Pool Party Magneto is. I think that... I, I When Boot and I were testing this, I think we saw, like, Pool Party Cyclops yeah, and Pool Party, pool party uh, Gambit. Oh, I gotta see Pool Party Nightcrawler, dude. Jugger versus Magneto. Magneto. Metal swimming trunks. <laughs> Fucking blob, dude. <laughs> what is? Oh, what? <laughs> Actually, all right. With the beach towel. <laughs> Let's see what the fucking plan is. All right, cool dude, doing some work with the Magneto immediately. Has a move. At least one move. I mean, the moves are actually like pretty standard in this game. Yeah, this game mostly has quarter circles and and sure use and fucking dude, charge moves and crap. I love a projectile that comes from the back side of the screen. Like that's so fun to me. All right, card night, though. Getting trying to get something. No, trying something. to get that, but the Juggernaut's game. Corner, though. Corner blocked, but corner. Juggernaut's damage the is whip. just so high. It can totally compensate. For Dude, one more hit. Chip him out. Single hit situation. Boom. I thought Magneto had that one in the fucking bag. Juggernaut. <laughs> Juggernaut. <laughs> trying to take it around one of this line, but let's see what's going to happen. Cool dude does not seem to be slacking either. Nope. Magneto's moves seem pretty neat in this game. I haven't really seen cool. him. Oh. Let's be careful. At some point we gotta just turn off the fucking pause hockey. That's for next week though. I tried really hard to figure out how to turn off hotkeys in this thing, but like couldn't. God I. damn dude! Oh my god. The juggernaut with the thum thum thum. Juggernaut. I can kind of click with this. This is like, I think this is a fighting game that's broken in an infinite setting. You should hit exit, by the way. I know. But also, oh, uh, hard night good. with the with the big victory in that one. But that's hard round one. Is thirsty for the run back, dude. That's round one. And if there's anything we've seen, it is that My cool dude has been a pretty flexible player. Yeah. In pretty much the whole of the tournament. But sticking with it. Sticking with the Magneto. Changing stage, don't want to look at fucking Blob anymore. I don't like looking at the Blob. I do not really enjoy it. I'm not I bet partial. The danger room's good in this game. <laughs> Bayou Hideout. Hideout. Bayou Hideout is one that I actually really wanted to see. This one, this one uh, seems cool. But also, potentially, potentially the last round until Grand Finals. We're going to see how this fucking shit shakes out, dude. Oh my god. Oh, and an eerie, thought-provoking match. Or get us in the mood. Oh, dude. The kick right away. The mag you can attack, like, before the, the little lights butt go. Oh, dude, Ooh, and knocked the out music, the air. too? Or something. All right. Got to get the geyser going. Really looking pretty good with the spacing right now, using that big old geyser that Magneto has to his advantage. But Juggernaut's normals are just yeah, so he's much better. So good block, so keep him alive. Full hit. And that stop. Nothing, nothing. And when you're in the corner, it just feels so hard to do anything about through. what Juggernaut has going. You gotta fight him back. And yeah, the stages hard. are very small. Juggernaut, if he gets you in a corner, it just feels like it's hard to escape at all. Get him. 
Where's the geyser? I feel like there has to be a fall off against that geyser. I don't know what it is, but like there's gotta be. Yeah, Kulu trying to figure something out corner. here, but in the corner, really have to get out, but I just don't know if Magneto has the, the, the mobility. Man, to get out. And of everybody just on the roster. Cross up, gets a little block. Too, too close for the geyser, too far. That would have been a great place for that little magnet rock projectile. Magneto dude. does have his level 3 super, but... No! Shredded dude. to dust by Juggernaut! Is that the run back? That's, I think that's it. Oh my god, Card Knight. Taking it over Cool Dude. Cool Dude with our third place finish. Cool Dude, cool dude with a really excellent run, though. I do want to make that completely fucking clear. Really, oh really God. excellent run from Cool Dude and Card Knight. Moving on to Grand Finals. Yeah, let's move him. Let's put him on the bracket. Ah. Cool Dude, thank you so much. So, Grand Finals. Well played. Grand finals, dude. I'm, I, I do want to say again, I'm so like actually thankful that everybody came up, came in. Everyone who's been hanging out in the group call, everyone who's been chilling and watching. Oh, yeah. By the way, but la last question that I want to ask before I use the bathroom, uh -huh. too. It's everyone's favorite game so far. Yeah, that's also. a great, great hypothetical of pastime. We're done with the wheels. You switched off game because he was a charge character? No. This stream's been awesome. It has been. What's everyone's favorite game? Because the wheel is done. Duruku Tenshi was so cool. Yeah, and that's such, like, a weird one. There's been so many, like, fun sets. So much weird shit. Evil Zone still. Evil Zone is something special. Waku Waku feels like such a you game, Tyler. Like, no joke. Cyberbots. I'm a Waku Waku head. I'd love to play some more Waku Waku. We were talking, and you were like, yeah, I want to do some more fighting game tournaments. And I was like, oh, you should do some things from Quibo. That one was in my fucking mind. This is, a. Uh, can you bring up the normal Quibo background? Yes, I can. I can bring up the normal Quibo We're going background. into grand fucking finals, dude. Which means I get to reveal our final game. That's true. And I'm so excited about it, because... I, last I checked... This game had, I think, five fucking downloads. I don't know if that's the case still, but last I checked, five fucking downloads on this thing. So, I highly doubt that any of you fuckers have ever touched it. I want this to be, like, a big, shocking, big thing. Is the Roblox second? No! <laughs> no! How do you even find this? You'll see. Cleave, what's the game? <clears throat> you want me to play it, play this thing? Yeah, play it. Right. What's the game? All right, all right, all right. All right, our last game is... Oh! Oh, hold on. I'm... Give me a... And ladies and fucking gentlemen, it's Gattaca Party Battle. Famous game, Gattaca Party Battle. Everyone's in, played this fucking in game, In case right? you've seen me uh, <laughs> talk about how I've been working on a fucking project for a million fucking years, every time that I've said, yeah, I've been working on a personal project for the past six fucking, fucking months, I've been making a Mugen mod. Oh my god. <laughs> Envy dog. Envy dog, thank you for the 200 fucking dollars. Whoa! <laughs> That's the price. That's the price to get this shit existing, dude. Jesus fucking Christ, dude. Here, here, Cleve, I'm going to send you the fucking moveset. This is going in... I'm going to put this one in general, dude. This one's going in general chat. Oh, 
All right. I've been making a full Mugen conversion mod. Special thank you to Cameron Shamron and BL for being my playtesters for the past five months and making sure that there's no infinites or bugs in this thing. Yay! Bring, bring up the little, whatchamacallit? The little Holy fucking shit. Yeah, isn't this a little shocker? What's isn't this a cute little surprise? It's in general. Can we just pull this picture up? Yeah, sure. Okay. Bring it up. <clears throat> Let's explore a little bit. Let's play around. I'm going to be posting this game here in the server immediately after Quivo. And the grand prize for winning Quivo is I have one skin slot left for every character. The top four of Quivo will get to put their own custom skin in my little video game. And whoever wins gets to pick the first character. Wow, here's our here's the moveset for, for Gattaca Party Bait Battle. Isn't this a little silly thing? <laughs> Boo! Oh, isn't that some air off my chest? Jesus Christ, dude. <laughs> oh, tweet this on my Twitter.com after tournament. Oh my god. You would have loved to see. <laughs> but dude, all the alt palettes are so fun. A lot of these alt palettes are fucking like esoteric knowledge required how did you keep quiet about this for so long i felt so bad because even in our mod chat i made a side one that was just me queeve noel and synth and i had to push all of my friends about it and i think they thought that we were being like really private how do you not tell anything because i wanted to do it here yeah <laughs> this has been taking up so much of my fucking time dude uh there's like a million yeah. fucking sprites in this thing and by the way this is a little different than the previous rounds of Quibo. For this one, because there's only four characters in it, you have to win with one of each of them. Yeah. To reset the bracket, you have to win with all four Quibo characters, with all four Gattaca Party Battle characters. To continue and win it, you once again have to do it. It's a first to four. I want to show this shit off. <laughs> yeah, so fuck, man. Our last game of Quibo is Gattaca Party Battle starring Tia and Card Knight. Let me close fucking X-Men. Fuck that game. Get the fuck yeah, out of the here. Yeah, get the hell out of here. Get the hell out of here. Get ass game. Woo! <laughs> let me let me just fucking launch Yeah, this. let's make sure the controls are right in it. They are already tested. They are? Oh, awesome. Dude, I'm so fucking psyched. I'm so like actually psyched. <laughs> oh <laughs> man. All right. Oh man, dude! Get the fuck in here. I got Tia and Card Knight. Get in. <laughs> Where did the music? All the music is just stuff from my stream playlist. It's all open to make stuff. They're all songs that you've probably heard before at some point or another. All right, Tia, you are gonna be player one. Card Knight, <laughs> you're gonna be player two. First to win with every character wins. Let's do a button test. This stage was a last minute addition. I'm glad that you saw it. Um, S is confirmed, by the way. Uh, if you want to do the alternate two palettes, you hold uh, the start button, which I think is... I have my fucking command channel. I'll dump that in here, too. Which I think is taunt. I think you hold taunt uh, and... Comma. I think comma should be... No, no. L? At K? I think K is going to be choose, uh, select for, uh, any, any one of the player attack. two. Any, any one of the attack buttons. Yeah, uh, I'm just, I, I guess that's true. It is whatever. There's, there's just different palettes. So yeah, I forgot, I forgot about that. Round one. All right, test your buttons, crouch. No one doesn't have a is. dash. He's too big. Uh, Polar Express is an armored move. You can cancel it by doing any heavy. That's forward B. Back B is a mid-air command grab. Lights cancel into heavies, cancels into specials. Uh, the commands are back there. If you hold back and press heavy and light, you get an assist. There's two assists on each character. If you uh, press light and special together and you have enough meter for it, uh, assist take one meter. Level one takes oh. Tyler drops from the sky. Oh yeah, you <laughs> test out your little specials and shit, dude. Aubrey heals you over time, but has a rough uh strong heal at the start of it. 
the first, like, split second. But those are also all combo breakers, so if you're getting combo to death in the assist, you can pop one of them, and it will force the opponent to block, because they're usually tracking projectiles. <laughs> yeah, good news, Aubrey. You didn't get a pallet, but you're already in the you're game. You're already in the video game. <laughs> I like that this is just, like... Was that a button test then? Yeah, that was a button test. That's a button test. All right, how do I exit to main menu? Uh, just press escape. All right. Okay. Want to do this shit for real? Ladies please? and gentlemen, this Maybe. shit's for real. Win with every character to win Quivo. Um, I'm gonna choose stages. You want to choose stages? Okay, that's fine. I just want to make sure we go through all of them. Fine by me. All right, round one: Carry versus Dialogue. Oh my god, alright, Carrie tried to get with the bird blast on uh, <laughs> Kia playing Carrie. That's the Woody Woodpecker tribute. That's a great combo starter. If you get a hard knockdown at any point, you can use a low light to launch them in the air and get a full combo off of it. <laughs> I'm so excited to to <laughs> All projectiles are jabbable. You can cancel out projectiles with jab or uh, I think it's just jab actually. Didn't I say if I was a fighting game character, I'd just have a gun like last year? Yes. Well, if you've ever heard us say anything about that sort of thing... I, oh, I have made it! Oh, Ooh. Amy, all right! Oh, cancel it! Tyler dropping, getting sent. Little pullback, little command yeah, forward. Right. Pardon it, Hanukkah, and all right. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> all right, let's see how round two goes, though. Yeah, let's see it. He thinks round one with the carry. Uh, since, uh, forward B, uh, if you choose the back version, it pulls the projectiles from the back half of the screen, and you can change the direction that it is either way. So you can push three projectiles forwards or pull them from the back like that. Yeah, yeah, you're getting it, you're getting it! Santa has a launcher on down special that pushes them in front of him and his jump cats have blown into a light. You're talking so fast. I know, I have so much to talk about! We gotta talk about our competitors. Can you too. talk about competitors? Honestly, the dial up looking pretty clean right now, dude. Getting some shit going. Carrie's a really like understandable character to pick up. Oh, oh it's a super. The super though. It's okay, keeping it down. Keeping it down, keeping the space. Tyler says block it. There's the overhead! Oh, uh, Carrie taking full advantage of it. Card night. Oh <laughs> Can't take in game one, dude. It takes game one with the carry. <laughs> One down, one down. Right, that's one down. Oh, popping the Robbie pallet. All right, all right. So now Card and I play in Noel. To you playing Boots. Boots pretty much the craziest. Boots my favorite guy dude. of the game, right? This matchup's really fun because Noel shits on him. <laughs> If you can get your grabs going, Noelle has a ton that she can just, like, shred him with. <laughs> Go for lights! If you get a knockdown, do a light! Do a crouching light! I don't know if they can hear you. I hope also, they can! Your, your I hope they can! Probably coming oh, cancel it, Aubrey! Get the short heal grab! Boom! But Noelle, Cardite needs to get that command grab. That'll do it! <laughs> Oh my god, alright, alright, alright. Dude, Boots is such an annoying little fucking <laughs> asshole. He's not that bad. Maybe on, honestly, on Parsec, Parsec Boot might be fucking something, dude. Parsec Boot might be something. Oh my god, Cardite just can't get out of it. Oh! <laughs> Breaking out Too with far. the Tyler, though, that's what you want. That combos into Command Grab on every, every time that you do it. Oh, the other hit! <laughs> oh, man, dude. Parsec boot is indeed a little devil. You would know. Oh. Uh, oh, uh, hold on. Let me, uh, quickly... That's TA with game two. I see Card Knight with the carry, though. One. Oh, 
man. You're just kind of watching. I know. I'm watching it. I'm watching it be played by people. Great DP. Yeah, good DP from Card Knight, but the Annie. And there's Annie. Blocks it. Avoid some big damage off that. Blocks it, but really Card smart right usage of the arrows, dude. DP here. through the arrows, huge. Oh man. No one knows the crouching lights. All right. Oh, too early. Too. The floopy was too late. Too late though. <laughs> too late though. Okay, real men. <laughs> Boom. You gotta capitalize it. It can be kind of hard to do that. But remember, it's kind of hard occasionally for Carrie to get in on six. Yeah, Carrie's combos are really, really strong, but it's all converting off of that knockdown. Oh my god, dude! It's just so hard to get in there here. Oh yeah, no one knows that Carrie's uh, air heavy is a projectile. Alright, trying to get moving, but... Good DP? Crouching light, come on. Yeah! Yeah! All right, you're, nice. getting, you're getting Good it! You're getting it! Dude, you know what you're doing, you're late. doing. Come on, card night! Come on! <laughs> oh. Dude, Tia wants that skin! Tia wants that fucking that skin, dude! That first fucking choice! Tia wants that first pick! Yup, yup! Yeah. <laughs> Potentially the last game of Quivo! Oh my god. Alright, let's see if Card Knight can bring it back with the boot. Which the taunt! A, mashing taunt! Which is a scary matchup! Mm -hmm. Is a scary matchup versus Noel. This could is one of those things that goes either way to the highest possible degree. Oh man. Into the air. They have a chance here. Boot Noel is one or the other. And oh. he's only the back half. Nice grab. All right. Trying to break out. Oh, Hard starts the combo. Blocks it. Oh, Hard Hard that is, that is, that is the back half. Hard Knight getting some stuff. Overhead. Overhead. For sure. Oh, uh, cancel the Polar Express for getting too deep in. Who has a double jump, by the way? <laughs> Who went so fucking high there? Yeah, he'd be doing that. Dude, a grab will do it! <laughs> I think we're getting a Tia sweep. I want to see Card Knight bring back some here. But this is also an overwhelming thing to be thrust into yeah, playing. Yeah, to be thrust into be like, hey, here's this video game that didn't exist until now. You're blunt. <laughs> oh! Catch her with the super. Catch her with the reversal. Huge super dodges the Noel attack and catches. Get her! Tia get her for shields! Gotta capitalize off of that a little bit. Nice little combo there. At least negated, I think, most of the healing, which puts Tia basically just back where she started. Start Hard Knight waking up with the boot the a little bit. Floofy, right, huge, huge, off. floofy! Cutting her off with the floofy! Oh no! It's not over yet, dude. It's not over yet. Nice slide. But the Tyler putting Carter in a bad situation. It's one hit! It's one hit! No! Oh, no! <laughs> oh. With the command grab! And Tia takes it! Tia clears! Jesus. Oh, please swap seats with me. Swap seats with me. I want to show off combos. Well, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. You're gonna, you're gonna, we're gonna hold on. I don't want to be, I want to at least go move stuff in the bracket. Okay, okay, okay. It's over. Sheepy Sweepy. Oh, with that, Tia. Congratulations on being the first ever Quivo champion. First ever Quivo champion, R Knight runner up. Ooh, in third place, and uh, Mako <laughs> in fourth. So, all four of you do get a prize. Yeah. All four of you can message me which character skin that you want in preference order, and I'll go through. Tia obviously gets first pick, R Knight. <laughs> yeah, congratulations.
Congratulations. I also put them in the wrong side. I should have put two yeah. here. It doesn't matter. Whatever. It was so hard not to tell Aubrey. Thank you, MP Thompson. You gotta chill out. Thank you for the $25, but jeez. Oh my You're god, insane. man. Doom, doom, doom. Oh, I'm so, I'm, I'm, I'm like so energized. This is what it feels like to release a video game, dude. Noel Nation, Nuclear Devastation. Oh, well, Card Knight, congratulations. I'm making it that far, though. Gift subs for me, the five Bio for the five gift subs. Yeah, you're like just tangled up in Minecraft That's right good. now. Oh my god, what the hell? That's too low. Give me the five gift subs. Thank you so much. Jesus Christ, it's been a crazy night. It has been a crazy night, hasn't it? Are you gonna do something crazy now? I don't know why it's gonna be player one thing. Whoops. Alright, well. Oops. I let you in my fucking chair for five seconds. Everything's already exploded. Look, Weeb, I wanna set my controls to what I'm used to using. You're better than everybody else? Mm -hmm. Jesus Christ. Hard Knight, thank you for the 10 gift subs, which is extremely unnecessary, man. <laughs> And Unexplored Blue, thank you for the 10 gift subs too, and Floofy, thank you for the 300 gay bits. You're all cracked. You're all fucking cracked. I don't think there's a single person here who doesn't have a fucking sub at this point. Let's see if we can figure this out. All right, what are you showing off? Uh, just the general gameplay loop of the video game, because it's very fun. Whoops. So, Boot is a little piano character. Oh yeah, I, I could show off all the supers. Yeah, that's what I was saying you should have done, because I, I, I... No one, I think, busted out almost any supers. Yeah. And those are pr Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. What's up? Thank you, Clodier, for the $50 <laughs> donation! Okay, so boot supers, uh, let me see, can I hit you? Uh, the train, let me see if I have the right button for this. I'll do my assist first. Ambi assist, full screen knockback, probably the most damaging assist that you have. Me and Sin both have that one. Boot shitter optimals after, I fucking have to. I think that's like a Tuesday thing. I'll show all the fucking combos that you got. We all just found like every character's fucking optimal combo. Yeah, we'll have a follow up to this. The train supers are reversal. If carries come at me with something like, uh, with that. I can't do that motion together, but I can pop three super. I managed to get that. Level three. Takes away half a health bar. It's a high-low block situation where if I want to be doing this, I think it's low, high, low. It's interesting that Bruce chose to kill me. No. Oops. If I go to carry. Carry's very fun. Oh, you have to show the taunts too. Oh yeah, the taunts. Let me let me do boot. Real quick. Real quick. Pop it. Got the uh... Fight. Where are you? That nope. There you go. There we go. Boot <laughs> hey, we got boot liquor. Hey, we got boot liquor on Everyone here is a sub. Can we get some boot liquor? What's bring get bucks? Carry has a new small. Uh, Carrie and Noel's taunts are mashable. Fight. Leaves moveset, bird blast. Carrie's famous roll is back. Use this one. Let's see, Carrie super, carry level one. First of all, I think I have Tyler will be really easy to see on boot. That's that one, falls from the sky. Oh, there's Eleanor. Combo system that I mentioned before, uh, if you manage to go for a crouching light, you go full combo after it, so you can really like extend it as far as you can. Eleanor super is huge, because if I manage to get that out, then it's like, you already start on your grounded combo. Oh, uh, that's my other super, boot block this, so I don't show what it is. Why? I guess I want to show it differently. So, carries level 3, if I pop it, uh, 
I could just wait with it. And I can mash block, I can move. If I say I'm boot, I'm gonna go for an action, like I'm gonna go for. Let's just go for like this one. Let's just pop heavy kick. And it's like just flip it, boom. Again, half health bar. There's ways for carry to combo into that one. Like if I pop. Let's see. Get up. I can use that and cancel really quickly. I'm not used to this one, so I might not. Oh, too early. There you go. That combos if you cancel the launcher. I managed to get my other thing. Carrie's basically Akuma. I've mentioned that. Her main move is throwing guns at you. Really funny. <laughs> Carrie ended up being Akuma. Carrie was originally going to have the Raging Queven. Yeah, I wanted to give her the Raging Queven, but you kind of see if I pop her to level three. See Synth. Synth is probably like my favorite character that I know. Party so um, oh, Baby Island. Oh, Party Baby Island. Yeah, that's important. Round one. Yeah! Look at this fucker. You all know this person, right? The, the sprite was supposed to be half the size, but aside, it's fine. It's fine. Huge. It's the it's four people combined. Oh, the old man? Yeah. So, Synth's a weird little character. This is an Amy skin. Let me walk boot up a little bit so I can show off what he does. Not that one. I think it's F, I'm just gonna it. Yeah. So you can choose direction midway through. So I can choose backside, front screen. If I'm at full screen where I generally want to be, because I can knock people back there, I can do something like that. Where it's like. And then I can cover that with this one. Put one on forwards to make sure that I wouldn't it out. We yeah, we patched it on infinite like a week ago. <laughs> Since level one, drum master. Synth obviously has Amy assist. Synth has Amy assist and Aubrey ready? assist. Oops, that's what I want. <laughs> and then, uh, what's it called? Since level three is a reversal, it's a really close range. You, you manage to connect it. Get a full combo launcher off of that. Resets you, sets you up. Now it's since level three. Synth probably hates this move. Synth it has a, a level three that's the antithesis of everything he is, which is very funny. He puts a chance time space down. And if I get it, I get a chance time on me. Which that one stole health from boot and gave it to me. So let's say that I just uh pop up. Let's say I pop that. Drop chance time. Oh, it doesn't work because it's training. Yeah, mode. I'm training mode. But not either be way, awful, but you get it. There's four random options. That one gave me half his health bar. You can get double health, single health, lose less health. It's less than either of them, or swap health entirely. So it means that if you really want to be evil about it, you can have something here. No one can punish you because it's unblockable. So boot has to play out in this zone, which means that you can set your projectile walls. Up your neutral one. This one is great for launching into level two. Are you ready? <laughs> yeah, I knew the boss of arcade mode is. I wish there was one. I want the arcade mode exist at some point. But... And let's pop Noel, dude. You can see a single Noel super. I don't know what fucking help this is. The main thing with Noel's is this is your sort of standard piece. Oh, it didn't. Oh, we're going to do that real quick. You're too excited to show everything. Oh, I am, I am. It's true, it's true. It's unsurprisingly since it. If you hold the button, he stays down. So you can either choose to mash it if you want, or you could just literally chill. Which actually happens with boots, too. I know his button is for that. You can hold both buttons. Technically, it low profiles some things. Not too much. Go on. Ah. Lastly, Noelle. Her sort of deal, even though her lows isn't combo and she doesn't have a dash. She doesn't have a dash, but she has this command dash that goes into all of her heavies. You can do that into grab, so I can be like, what? Don't be scary. Don't. Her big deal is that this one, if you're close enough to the edge, you get the full launcher off of it. Which is really fun. 
can cancel out of that one, but... <laughs> so, no, I'll, like, shit's damage. What's your, what's your tonic? Noel Jack. Noel drop. Level 1 super. Can I make this connect? Yeah. Shoot. Markable plushie. Which is a classic. You swing it, and if you manage to do that, duh, duh, duh. If I manage to get that up close, you do get the full combo, and you can basically guarantee going into this. And then her other one is... Let me see if I can get this to show off how it works. For something like this, where it's a sort of quote-unquote, not high profile, but a higher move. If you do her level 3, you can slide under it and catch them with the new helicopter. <laughs> so, you've got everything, dude. That's, that's the whole Quivo lineup. That's the character roster. Chairback. You can take your chair back. Oh. <sighs> That's what I've been working on for the past fucking six months. <laughs> you cannot believe this. It's so fun, dude. I'm gonna dump this in... Where should I dump this, Cleve? Um... Uh, well, I think one cool place you could dump this I mean, in the Discord, the clearly. Discord, which everybody should join, by the way, if you want to be a part of cool stream events like this, and also if you want to... I'll just stay on the screen. You can just keep looking at the game happen. I'm gonna dump and pin it in a video game. Uh, if you want the first place to fucking have access to Gattaca Party Battle, then you better join the goddamn Discord, because I imagine this will end up on Twitter and probably somewhere else at yeah. some point. But for now, I think it's probably just gonna be yeah, for now it's Discord the Discord only. first, so... Uh, join the Discord if you're not already in it! I'm just gonna do all our plugs now, because it's been five hours. It has been five hours, that was the perfect time. As always, there is a YouTube, and the wonderful Floofy does all the editing on YouTube. New VODs go up every Thursday. Please check out our last one, which was of our Pride stream. Another which was such a was good VOD, dude. Another project that was very near and dear to Boots Heart. Um... There is a Twitter, if you want to follow what we're doing, and we're going live that way. And there is an archive channel to watch full unedited buzz. Uh, do you have any plans to add anything to this? Um, I would love to. I think DLC at some point. More characters eventually. I think it'd be fun. Oh, who wins this matchup? That's just showing I've been I've been running so many... Like, I like, like saying who wins this matchup when it's just the demo. Not, oh yeah, the BL skin. <laughs> not like a real thing. You'll see, huh? I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it, dude. I feel like it's inevitable. Yeah, I could get this. Uh, I can see like one more character right next year. I could get this video to Floofy, and this could just be uploaded onto the YouTube too. I think that's probably a good idea. You should be in for DLC. It's your birthday. I thought about putting people in one of the stages, but I didn't want to. I he presumpted like, and can't find personas. Yeah, I feel I feel like it like that'd be, be fun for uh, first attack crowd. Shot the shit out of him for this dude. God damn. Um, but that's it. I think that's kind of it. That was Clevo. This is is now downloadable in the Discord if you ever want to play it. <laughs> Thank you all for coming, dude. What a game. Um, yeah, this was a huge one. Thank you all for showing up. Thank you for watching me stream for five fucking hours with basically the same amount of people here the whole time. That's crazy to me. Uh, someone also said Gattaca Party Battle Tournament win. Probably eventually. Probably relatively soon. I want to let Cook for a little bit. BL does have the optimal combo for every single fucking character, which is so funny. Noel can just, like, melt you down to five health. I think Noelle used to have a one-tap on boot, which I don't know if she still does, but I think so. Um, but... No, you do not get banned from that one. That one you're in, dude. Uh, but we... 
don't know. We'll be back on Tuesday with something. We'll be back on Tuesday with something. This is a big this. one. It's 11.40. Yeah. I need to rest my little vocal cords. Because I'm going to have crazy commentator voice tomorrow. Oh, absolutely. I this hope was, that everybody had fun. This I hope was a phenomenal that, stream. I hope that you liked all of the various games that you saw. Again, congratulations to Tia, our winner. Congratulations to Carter. Oh, Fanner, Fanner. Cool Dude and Mock Roach, our top four. And uh, thank oh, you for God, the yeah, crazy amount of fucking subs, dude. Yeah, thank you for all being fucking literally insane, dude. I I can't even believe what happened. That was and, and that, that was so many little donations and so many uh so many gift subs and just fucking <laughs> like you're you're all crazy. Don't fucking fuck me, dude. Thank you, Kimbo, for the gift sub. Aww. But everybody, you had better stop. <laughs> Y'all better stop. Congrats to all top four. I'll reply in the. Uh, we have a little bit of fan art. I feel like just a little bit, just a little bit today. Who are top four? Tia. Can't believe you forgot. Already. Card night. Tia, card night, macro school dude. Uh, what was the order of the last two? Tia, card cool night, dude. cool dude, macro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh. Nato drew this a while ago. It was exclusively in the, uh, what you call it? This was in the Quibo Competitor Block Little channel, and it goes fucking crazy. Nato drew everybody who was competing. I really like the detail of everybody having a different colored, like, sashes and details and stuff based on the color of their pool. I think it's a smart move. It's adorable. It goes kind of crazy. Thank you, Nao. I, I I already said this was really cool in the Kibo channel, but this is really cool still. That has not changed since I said it the first time. Uh, also, this was on our pre-stream, but thank you, Mockroach, for uh, baking this fucking bad boy up. It's, this goes. It's so fucking cool. Fuck. Every single person. It's cool as fuck. Thank you. Um, we have. Top Gun Arcade, inspired by the majesty of playing Evil Zone with Dio. Good Evil job. Zone, kind of. Jesus, dude, that's awesome. I think this is awesome. I I think this goes fucking crazy. Thank you again, by the way. Special shouts out to Pop Gun Arcade for being a last minute good sport and being in the bracket. Yeah. Uh, the person who was originally going to be in Pop Gun Arcade slot uh, was unable to make it, so I just looked at the applications and was like, you know, Pop Gun Arcade's always here. Fucking. You were in the box slap tournament. You can hang. Uh, so thank you for 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 showing up. <laughs> From Cinna, we got uh, Sonic the Fighters, the one game I was hyped for, very hyped for. You're sure a little little knack. What, dude? We had so many fucking fun games. Thank you so much. Uh, oh god, and our last thing is Trinket. One of the many misinterpretations of Sensei. I think that's like cute though. Usually that's the Sensei trinket. interpretations are kind of like scary. Oh, I'm gonna roll credits and it's probably gonna be a long ass credits reel. Yeah. Thank you for showing up, everybody. I see you all later. Thank you for coming. You're all wonderful. Good night. Bye bye. Bye bye. Thank you.